Hello, hello, hello. Sorry for the delay there. I broke my avatar again. Um, uh, I had to fix that real quick. So how is everyone doing this evening? Oh. There we go. Uh, I'll take a moment to catch up with chat. Oh, wow. You guys have been chatting. Uh, yes. Hello. Hello, Kenneth. Welcome to the stream tonight. I hope you're doing well this evening. Uh, Cryo Xerxes. Hey there. Caught the beginning this time. Yeah, excellent. Uh, it's always nice to be, uh, to be in the loop on everything. It's, uh, I'm never am. It's, it's always, it's always nice to get here. I, I didn't announce the stream today because I wasn't sure there was going to be one. Um, we've had some serious storms in the area, so it's kind of knocked out my internet a lot. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I am a golden xenomorph. Oh, I assume that's probably from the avatars. Uh, I just realized I didn't save my avatar properly. It gave me the skull head, but I had it on the purple square dude. Oh. Uh, I'll have to look at that and see if there's something going on. It, I may have ended the stream too soon, and it didn't save your stuff. Uh, oh, never mind. <laughs> right. Uh, his body's just below the screen. I, I'm going to be fixing some of that stuff. We're still kind of playing around. I, my head is very weirdly. I've got my camera set up weird, so if I if I drift a little bit, I'm sorry. Uh, but we're going to be adding like some groundage for you guys to walk on, uh, so you'll be able to see your characters a little bit better. Um, hug. Hug back. Uh, I didn't know there was going to be a stream today. Uh, hey there, welcome to the the stream Starfall. Um, I didn't know if there's, there was going to be a stream today either. <laughs> uh, generally, from now on, I'm planning on Saturday and or Friday and Saturdays to be the official um kind of stream, and I'll keep, I'll, of course, keep it updated. Uh, we just we had some storms coming through this area that kind of knocked out our internet, so I wasn't sure. Uh, Cryo Starfall, how was your day? Good. Uh, so so didn't get much sleep. Oh, that's not good. I hope I hope you didn't stay up too late last night with us. Uh, I did. I did. I did not go to sleep until like three o'clock. So, <laughs> uh, I was dumb. Uh, I did not get much sleep either. Five in the morning, Kenneth. Jeez, you need to you need to work on that, my bud. <laughs> that's not that's not good for you. But then again, well, you know, I was also up till three, so I can't judge. Uh, my normal bedtime is nine, and I didn't hit the sack until 14, 30. Ugh, military time. I don't know what that is. <laughs> or not military. Is that military time? I don't remember how that one's set up. Uh, mine is supposed to be eight. Uh, creatures of the night rise up. Yeah, yeah. I, I used to go to bed at like 11. Uh, I will change my skin. Be right back. Absolutely. Uh, cryo Xerxes. Hey, uh, making chicken glazed rice. Oh, that sounds amazing. I actually had Szechuan uh, shrimp for my dinner. Uh, I used to not sleep at all until I got tired eventually. Yeah. Whenever I was young. Oh God, I'm old. Uh, <laughs> whenever I was young, uh, I had really bad insomnia. Uh, I'm right now animating something. So right now I'm on my PC, not the other device. So I'm not really paying attention. That is totally fine. I am a okay with that. Uh, hi, uh, 2 30 PM. Uh, just seeing your Pokemon fusion video is good. Oh dear. My head is twitching. Thank you. Um, we, we, uh, <laughs> I was, uh, planning on doing more of that. I just don't know yet. We're, we're going to have to keep going with the, uh, the, what do you call it? The jungle theme. Uh, I think though, next time we're going to probably going to be doing some, uh, more dinosaurs actually come to think of it. So, uh, hopefully, hopefully you'll enjoy that. Um, all right. So today we're going to be continuing in with, um, Slay the Princess. Um, we're going to continue down that route, and we're absolutely 100% not getting the four endings again. 
We're staying away from getting swallowed. I can't, I can't handle it. I had nightmares. Uh, could you do the prehistoric ones? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we're probably going to have like, um, a rural, uh, and, uh, Tyrantrum. Cause I'd like to see some, uh, Noivern fusions with those as well. Uh, I fell asleep at 5 a.m. because I had terrible time sleeping. Oh, geez, that's not good. Well, hopefully you get some better sleep tonight. That's uh, that seems to be a common amongst all of you guys. 5 a.m. <laughs> uh, I'm talking about the Pokemon Fusion wins. Pokemon Fusion wins. I'm not sure. what that means. Sorry. Um, I'm going to go ahead and start up the game real quick so that we can jump in and uh, start getting ourselves some princesses. Just some, some sweet little princesses. Uh, today, I'm actually going to try getting one myself. Uh, it can make another suggestion. You should totally mix in Porygon as a fun digital twist on the prehistoric I always forget to do Porygon. I want to add Porygon to like everything because I, I feel like he's going to have some really cool reference fusions like um, Transformers, things like that. I don't wait. Is that digital? Uh, I don't know, <laughs> but uh, I, I always want to add in Porygon. I forget about him. I forget about but all three of them a lot. Uh, we want Slay the Princess. I'm sorry, we're not doing stomach endings. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I I just can't do it today. We can we can try again later with that, but I I can't be in the stream today. Oh well, that's that's okay. Um, White Shark, hey, welcome. Uh, hopefully you're not having a bad day or anything. Or is it the four thing? Does the four thing upset you? It upsets me. Uh, me go another house for group meeting. Well, I hope you have fun. You know, you got to live your life. I can, I can absolutely appreciate that. So let's, uh, let's switch over here and pull up the game. Uh, you can always come back and join us for the, uh, a watch later. I, I hope you have fun, you know, uh, get whatever group project you're doing done. Uh, the Vor thing was gross. Yeah, I don't, it's too much. Now, if it's an ending that we don't have to go back into the stomach, we could take a look at that, but uh, I can't stomach it. No, I really can't. I had a nightmare last night, and I, in fact, the whole night was just nightmares as I fell asleep. So uh, we did, we absolutely had to uh, avoid that one for now. Are you talking about no more stomachs? Is that what the V thing is? Yeah, uh, I'm sorry. I, I'm common knowledge. I, I don't know what common knowledge is. Um, Vor is <laughs> gross. I, I genuinely don't know how to explain it. It is like being eaten. And uh, there are people in the world who are find that thing kind of thing very entertaining. I do not. So I I just I can't today. <laughs> it's it's one of my primal fears being eaten. Yes. Of uh, yes, it is absolutely. <laughs> Uh, there are movies that have like people getting eaten in them and that just creeped me out. I think the Rampage movie uh, had a scene in which a person gets picked up and swallowed by the gorilla and I couldn't watch beyond that. I just like it was disgusting. Uh, could you tell me your nightmare? 
You don't have to, of course. Um, sure. So I actually dreamt that I was eating a bowl of people. I don't, I'm not going to go into too much detail there, but I was eating cereal and it turned out it was people and I vomited. Uh, it's more the opposite of fear and not my cup of tea myself. Oh, the, the Vor thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I just, I can't, I, like you said, I can't stomach it. It's, it's too much for me. Uh, now, if, like I said, if the ending is something we can get to without going back into the gut, I will do it. But for, for today, at least. We're going to load the game. Mmm, it's still there. Uh, let's pop back over here. We path in the woods. We have no beginning and we have no end. But something cold and unnatural sits watching us from just beyond our edge. Um, could you tell me your nightmare? It's more the opposite. Mm, no. <laughs> uh, sorry for the joke, Star. Oof. Yeah. I, okay. So we're we're actually going to move away from the four. We I think we've got one more ending here, which I believe is going to be the fight the. Oh, hey, hey, Linda, how are you this evening? Uh, welcome to the stream. Uh, you got eaten last stream? <laughs> yeah, we got eaten. Um, unfortunately, the Beast Princess decided to swallow us alive. Uh, uh, 10 Nicole leaders. Three in here. Oh, we need to see what happens at the end. So you want to save here. Oh, this is, um, this is actually one of our saves. Uh, this is, this is our, our return to point. He got eaten like a snake because he played dead. Yeah. You know, I don't know why more animals don't do that. This gaze pushes against our borders, curling them in on themselves preventing them from stretching to the places they need to reach. See, oh, this... No, that's all wrong. You're not a path in the woods, you're on a path in the woods. Who's even saying that? This ending was very disturbing to me. I thought, like, it was going to be like, oh, we're inside, that's but I think this is more of a... Princess, is it? A fundamental oh, no. kind of deal. How many times have you been here? I think this is our third? Oh. That's bad. Yeah, That's I remember that, yeah. Very, very bad. It wasn't even supposed to reach two. There Before are three endings reset. here. Oh, there are. Okay. Things aren't the way they're supposed to be. Oh, isn't that fun? He's upset. <laughs> I love the contrary, and he's so good. Of course I'm upset. The world is at stake here, as I'm sure you already know. Let's get our facts straight. What happened last time? What could you have possibly done for things to be like this? Play dead. The thing that sits beyond our edge speaks his logic into us. He tries to grasp at things that cannot be grasped. Uh, there are three, and you can also get this ending from the witch if you choose to kill her at the beginning instead of giving her the blade. You fight her, but then you get crushed by the vines. Oh, okay. So this isn't just like a purely he tries to stare swallowed with wide pupils at that which can only be held from the corner of the eye or with a passing glance. Shut up. The rest of <laughs> just... you can talk. What happened? What did you do? Can she hear us if we talk? I can hear everything, little one, but you don't have to be afraid of me. There's no place where you end and I begin. Nothing can hurt you here. No uh, oh, oh, I did not mean to do that. 
I like that. Uh, also, you can get this I ending. Uh, so but yeah, there are three endings. Put it like that. Yeah, um... So on this route, I think we're probably right now we're probably going to go with the joint side with the narrator. Small. Unfortunately, even if you act that way, we're both so much more together than we were apart, and we can be so much more still, vast, unfathomable. If you really want to know what happened, we tried playing dead, <laughs> and she ate us. Yeah, she ate you. And now you're convinced that you're stuck together. What a mess. <laughs> yeah, that's my feel. Understand. We aren't convinced of anything, and we aren't stuck together. We're one. This is how we're supposed to be. Can't you feel it? Oh, I can feel everything. Sure, being one with the princess is pretty great, but what can we even do right now? Hope we're not supposed to just passively exist like this. I did not sign up for passive existence when we faked our own death. Oh, the passive. Can we do the passive? Let's do the passive existence one. Uh, but there are three, so we're helping the narrator. Um, I, I was going to help the narrator, but then I forgot about the passive existence. So we're going to try the passive existence. I feel like that one's going to be fun. Uh, passively no, exist. Please, anything. I'm sorry, Contrarian. I love you, but you can't just passively exist forever. Not with her. That isn't how it works. Oh yes, it is. Ate you last time. Stop passively vibing with a literal predator. <laughs> and remember that your enemies. Remember what she's done to you, and how much it hurt. Uh, the vibing line got me because today I was talking to my sister and I said the word vibing and she said you've never used the word vibing before you started streaming and I was like there's a lot of things I've never said before I started streaming so apparently when you stream um it changes you we fundamental oh back to that. we can't go back to the fear and the hunger and the pain not after being something wow. as beautiful as this Oh my god, okay, she lost it. Doesn't all that conflict feel so far away right now? So petty? We've been posed against each other by something that understands the strength of our unity. Uh, I think that's one is something we already got. Oh, is it? Uh, you never said Google on stream before either. Yeah, um, I we gotta be careful with that because... <laughs> There's one in the back of my house, and it's been going off like randomly. I feel a thumping, a heartbeat, <gasps> like a distant terror that keeps getting louder the more we pay attention. Oh. Please, stop. If you let it in, we'll fall apart. Don't look oh. at it. Oh. Maybe a little peek wouldn't hurt. Aren't you curious? Kind of now Are that she's curious? losing it. You should look. Never mind. If he wants <laughs> okay. to look, then I don't want I to. love this guy. He's amazing. Uh, bury it now before it's too late. Gaze at the terror in your heart. Um, I know what will say bad... What? I know, I know what will say bad things. Oh, oh, I see. You're talking about the Google. Turn around and look. No, wait. Save the game here. Okay, yeah, I guess... Oh, oh shoot. Well, I didn't do that because I dropped my phone on the keyboard. Ah, crap. Uh, what did I click? Just like that, you start to fall apart. Wait, what? What did I hit? I can remember it now. I didn't like being eaten. I'd forgotten how much it burned, and the air was so hard to breathe. And she didn't care. She didn't care at all. Oh, we must have clicked the horror. As you remember the terror and pain you felt at the hands of the princess, you start to remember something else, too. You remember that you are a distinct being with a finite form and a mortal body. Oh. You can feel it. 
I hate that there is shit. A shifting of the space around you, the infinitesimal movement of your molecules rearranging back into the shape of what you're meant to be. Oh man. Finally, something is happening. I honestly didn't know what to make of all this. Bit too metaphysical for me. It's hard to have a goof when you're stuck being metaphysical. That's fair, no. you know. Oh. I devoured you. I won. I put things back the way they were supposed to be. Uh, she's absolute. Some oh, the wound can never truly be. Oh no! It's the cabin. Rips across whatever it was you thought you were. Oh. The cabin comes into being among the trees. It approaches, and it swallows your body whole. Oh my god, a cabin? How many times have I got to get eaten? Don't! And you find yourself, oh. blade in hand, exactly where you need to be. What the hell? This is... It's still it's better than the stomach. The princess, a wooden and fleshy heart beating with an oh, it's wood. rhythm. You're filled with a sense of purpose. Strike at her. End this once and for all. Uh, this one's a good one. Oh, okay, good. Uh, safe here? Oh. She looks so defeated. I don't... I... Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. I feel empty, don't you? Oh, she feels so defeated. I think we should kill her. It would annoy him if we didn't, right? I'm kind of with the contrarian again. I mean, I'm always going to side with the contrarian, I think, but... She isn't dangerous anymore. We could leave her. We could both live. Do we have to do this? It does feel really gnarly to kill her. You have to. You know you have to. Oh, I never wanted to kill you. Not really, but we can't be the same thing as each other. I had to put an end to whatever happened to us. Cut her free. I'm going to cut her free. Little bastard. If you think I'm going to let you free her, you have another Two thing coming. Two ways to do it. Okay, well, I'm going to free her. Yeah, you know what? Fuck you, well, narrator. thing is... We'll just have to wait and find out when it happens. Ignore him. His words only confuse us. Just do it. You're tired, aren't you? No, I'm not. I'm... Fine. Whatever. You cut the princess oh. down the bombs that bind her. I hope you're happy. Good luck getting her out of here. Ha! <laughs> That's right. See that us. <laughs> I thrive on your frustration. I didn't think you would do that after everything. Well, you know, don't get used to it because I'm going to have to kill you in a minute. It's so cold without you. Oh. Bye. But you don't get the chance to respond, nor will you ever. It's time to leave. She's Memory gone. returns. She's Where gone. Did she go? No, he's gonna talk. Should we try and find her. And there's that mirror up there. Why is it here? Why now? Uh, I just, I can't, I can't with the voice in this mirror anymore. This, this doesn't feel right. It feels, yeah. Don't look at it. I don't like that. I'm thing. sorry. There's actually no the choice. Thing weeks of death. Oh, does it? The voices feel small and distant as you approach. Uh, they're gone once again. The mirror always makes them leave. You've withered. Oh. I think we've withered before. Approach her. Oh. I am a growing chorus of contradiction. A mass of tides ebbing and flowing all at once in more directions than my attention can bear to hold. 
To look at any one is to shift them all into something new. And to look oh, away is to reshift I hate the way head. she looks. She's so, like, <laughs> I don't know, this is all worse than the heart. Is changing, and yet the rest of me is still the same. Uh, use withered? Withered. Oh, use, I, I see, I see. Use withered. Uh, I want to know what she thinks of this uh, body. Uh, leave behind. Kill you right. Uh, what do you think of this vessel? This one is like a shadow of me. Twisting vines in search of answers. She will make for a curious heart. Oh, a curious heart. Okay. That's interesting. Do not mourn her. She has found what she yearned for. Okay, uh... All right, when you want to kill her, let me know. Um, all right, so we need to go back here and just murderize her? Murder later? Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. What is that? The telltale heart? The one with the... You can hear the heartbeat under the... <laughs> Wait, what happened to her? Um, so this is the one where we end up waiting patiently. And then I guess we sided with the narrator and it kind of broke her. We basically tore ourselves away from her and she turned into a tree. Uh, also, we got to do the one other ending when we found the pieces of the mirror and we saw the greenery. Oh, do we need to do that one again? Does that matter? Because I'm just going back. Anyway? I don't think we should kill her. It would annoy him if we didn't, right? I'm sorry, Contrarian. I have to. She isn't dangerous anymore. We could leave her. I kind of hate this ending. We could both live. I do absolutely love the Dryad vibe, though. Except when we do cut we her have out. To do this, you have to. Okay. You raise the blade, oh. take aim at her heart, and then you strike. This is this feels cruel. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. Oh. She's gone. And there's that. Oh boy. This yeah. That. You've withered. Oh, uh, you find yourself in the long quiet once again. Is she going to be different this time? Oh. I am a growing chorus of contradiction. Oh, a it. A mass of tides ebbing and flowing all at once in more directions than my attention can bear to hold. To look at any one is to shift them all into something new. And to look away is to reshape them yet again. Uh... What does she think of this one now? Ask her? All of me is changing. And yet the rest of me is still the same. Uh, let's see. What do you think of this vessel? This one is like a shadow of me. Twisting vines in search of answers. She will make for a curious heart. Do not mourn her. She has found what she yearned for. Okay, so it looks like it's about the same. Cool. Uh, <laughs> it doesn't matter. I don't think any of this is uh, canon. By the way, why is the chat bubble on the floor? It's like close to the floor. Wait, was it? Oh, uh, for the SA? Steam avatars? Uh, could somebody leave... Uh, pop in real quick. Oh, 
Yeah, what is that? What What is going on there? Uh, I'm not sure why that's doing that. Let me... I'm going to shrink down the, uh, the chat bubble size. And see if that fixes anything. Um, chat bubble scale. Let's, uh... And I'll make you guys bigger as well. Let me just do a quick test. Oh my god, she's so creepy in the background. Okay, so that... I guess fixed it. If if it keeps going, let me know. Uh, I can't actually see what's going on on this little screen. Did you read my text? Uh, not yet. Sorry, I'm trying to fix the uh, chat bubbles. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait. I remember now. It only matters at the very end when you see your true love for the first time at the end. Uh, before you see the narrator, or I mean after you see the narrator, then you see her. And then you will see the new stuff. Um, the new stuff. Oh boy, where did I leave it? <laughs> I gotta find that save. Load. This one. Yes. We are a path in the woods. There we go. We have no So you said there's ending, one more ending here? And we have no end. The heart but and the other path you rescued her watching us from the from trees. Just beyond our edge. Yeah, so um we'll have to pick one for our third one. Uh is that the one you're wanting me to pick? The one where we get the narrator? You stabs her in the heart, and the other one you freed her. Yes, uh, the 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 tree one. Yeah, we freed her, and um... his gaze pushes against her. No, 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 that's not. Oh, that's bad. Oh, of course. Let's get off. The thing he tries to shut. Can she hear? I can. Oh, oh, that's if she. He doesn't. Sure. Okay, here we go. Uh, why are you being so nice to me? Aren't you the monster? Didn't you eat me? Uh, so you said there's a third ending here. One. I'm not watching you. I'm trying to help you. That's not an answer. To I don't know. I do want. He wants us. To I don't. She's. Uh, right. Are, are we trying to get back to the one where um we saw the world crack? Or is this a different one? Passively exist. Ha <laughs> ha. That's what I do. That's actually most of my existence is passive. She only one. She's the only one who possesses a poses a threat. Possesses a threat. Uh, all right. I've had enough of this guy. How do we stop him? Okay, let's say I want to stop her. What do I do? Passively exist. Why should anyone do anything right now? This is fine. I like being this. Uh, why are you being so nice to me? Aren't you a monster? Didn't you eat me? Uh, I feel the pressure of the outside pushing on us. Uh, I don't like this. Okay, you, narrator, how do I stop her? Uh, option one. I've had enough of this guy. How do we stop him? Push back. 
She's trying. Uh, explore. Remember how it felt. Turn inward and find your freedom. Uh, push, uh, turn inward and find my free. You fall inward into a network of connections too vast for your mind to occupy. Are you a path in the woods? Are you a body? Can you even grasp the fuzziest edges of the shapes that confine you? Yeah, uh, the, there's a bit of a delay. Unfortunately, uh, like I said, we we've got like storms and stuff, so my internet's going to be to fill them together. pretty crappy today. We don't need to be everywhere. We just need to test the boundaries. You'd do best to remember that some wounds will never heal. Some rifts can never be mended. Even in rebirth, some things never come back the same. What is he going on about? What does he know about us? Screw all of this, and screw this guy in particular. <laughs> always telling us what we can and can't do. Always going on and on about rules and the fate of the world. I've had enough. Can we... Sure. You aren't whole. You'll never be whole again. This struggle is meaningless. Whatever you think you're doing, you will fall apart we don't need to be made whole all we need to do is find a single corner of his cage and break it i hate this veiny stuff stretch and search <laughs> and stretch and search growing as you decay and decaying as you grow as you strain beyond your limits the ground around you becomes dry and unstable and crumbles into nothing beneath you this place will fall apart before you find its end this task whatever it is you think you're doing is impossible all he has are words and words aren't real we're real. Yeah! Ruin <laughs> his death. I absolutely love the contrarian. Uh, Josephine thing are roots. Oh, the, the lines. The so Ryan lines are literally. trust me? You won't find oh, shit. anything if I... Sorry. But you do find something. It's cold, smooth, and uh, gently buckles under the cracks. Under... The pressure of your consciousness flattening against Don't it. Move an inch. Don't grow another blade of grass or harvest the remains of another dying creature so you can expand just that much further. Stop all of this right now. Yeah. I think it's too late for that, mate. I'm at your side. Shatter it. Shatter the cage. No, 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 stop. But his pleas disappear at the sound of the breaking glass. For a moment, you and she gaze through the tiniest hole in the world at the place you need to be. Is this what he kept from us? Is this why he made us kill each other? This beautiful. Is it though? We need to be there. We won't be safe until we are. We won't be whole. Eh. Doesn't look that great. <laughs> I like it better in here. No, 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 no. Stop. Uh, I don't have the option to stop. Where did it go? Why is everything so cold? But you never get the chance to answer her. You turn to see you've gone behind you. Uh, her gone behind you. Memory returns. No, oh, that's what he said. Okay, I see. Where did she go? I was gonna say I, I might have she messed it up and didn't have the option to stop it. And there's that mirror again. Why is it here? Why now? 
Of course you're scared. This is the what end is for you. <laughs> Whatever awful thing I felt before, it feels so much worse now. Death. Real death. He's just messing with us. Right? Yeah, of course I am. You approach the mirror. Uh, so we're going to figure out what we think of this vessel. Then I have an idea for the Din Beast again. Okay. If it involves going back into the stomach, we're not doing it. I'm sorry. I just can't. Uh, proceed to the cabin. Oh. I am a growing chorus of contradiction. A mass of tides ebbing and flowing all at once in more directions than my attention can bear to hold. To look at any one is to shift them all into something new, and to look away is to reshape them yet again. All of me is changing, and yet the rest of me is still the same. Huh. So that sounds a lot like the last one. What do you think of this vessel? This one is like a shadow of me, twisting vines in search of answers. She will make for a curious heart. Okay. Do not mourn her. Okay, so that she seems like that was about the same. Uh, no, 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 we're not doing the stomach, at least not for now. Okay. Uh, I could tell you what happens. Um, yeah, either way, that, that's totally... Oh, shit. I gotta stop dropping my phone, man. Um, are we are we gonna go back to the Din Beast on this one? I've got to figure out which one that one was. I think it's this one. The forms are really interesting, though. They seem to be kind of like the uh... put the phone. Oh, uh, I I actually do have it uh, on my desk. That's why I'm dropping it. I'm knocking it over when I look at chat. Uh, I have to pick up my phone to actually get close because I have, um, I'm going blind, basically. Uh, yes, we go back to the den. Okay. Yeah, we are. And this time we're not going to run until we die. We're taking her head on and we're winning. You felt her. She didn't have a soft underbelly. She didn't have blind spots. What could we have done that would have saved us from her hunger? When someone tries to make you dead, you have to hit them back. You have to show them your authority. There's nothing worse than a bully that thinks they own you. Great. So you've been here before. That doesn't bode well. You're not supposed to have been here before. This is supposed to be one and done. Oh, shut up. It bodes fine. You're the reason we're stuck in this shit situation. Now I have to do the hard work of dragging us out. One shots never are just one that? and done. We're going to fight her and we're going to win. There's a reason she slinks around in the shadows. It's because she's ugly. No complaints here. Now hold on. We're not just going to let the fact that he knows things about this whole looping situation go, are we? He's not important. He can have his secrets for all I care. She's killed us twice now, and that's enough of a reason for us to want her dead. Alright, okay, what's the plan? The path is different than it was before. I want answers. What's going on here? What do you know that you're not telling me? Uh, what if we just leave? What happens then? No matter what happens next, it seems like all our answers are in the cabin. Let's see this through. Uh, silently proceed, and I'm done with this. Bye! Option number two, okay. Ground is ground. It doesn't matter what shape it takes. We'll adapt. If it looks different, that's because the situation has started to spiral out of everyone's control. So please, disavow yourself of the notion that you can just come back here and fix this place if you manage to make a mess before that line of thinking leaves you yet another world in ruin. 
though as evidenced by you dying twice, it's safe to assume the fates of the worlds you've left behind don't concern you very much. They really don't. Consider this <laughs> your last opportunity to make things right, for you and for the rest of existence, but especially for you. We don't need your pep talk. I'll make sure we pull this off. Um, actually, voice of the stubborn. I'm gonna fuck up everything, trust me. Uh, okay, what's the plan? I want answers, what's going on here? Uh, what if we just leave? Uh, no matter what happens next, it seems like our answers are in the cabin. Silently proceed to the cabin. I'm done with this, bye! Bye! Uh, then number two. I've told you as much as I can without putting you at a disadvantage. If anything, I've told you too much. Like that grumbling voice said just a moment ago, you've already died by her hands twice. You shouldn't need much else in the way of motivation. Okay, what's the plan? What if we just leave? What happens then? No matter what happens next, uh, it seems like our answers are in the cabin. Silent proceed to the cabin. Uh, I'm done with this. Bye. <laughs> We're gonna leave the cabin. The last one. You okay. have already committed to my completion. You cannot go further astray. Oh yeah, I think we've done that before. She won't let us leave. Uh, okay, what's the plan? What if we just leave? No matter what happens next, it seems like all our answers are in the cabin, and silently proceed to the cabin. I do like the music here. It, it actually fits the uh, the video I put out today. Option number three. You make your way down to the cabin. So we need a plan. We've already been over the plan. I'm not sure that use violence <laughs> counts as a plan. It usually does, it's a though. Better plan than you had last time. I don't like this. Don't try to keep us breathing. Proceed into the cabin. The interior is dark and overgrown. Vines and brush obscure so much of the place that, had you not seen the exterior, you might not have noticed this was a cabin at all. Uh, also, the beat of the drum reminds me of Believer? Believer. The only furniture of note, if you could call it that, is a knotted stump. A pristine blade embed the blade as your implement. You'll need it if you're going to do this right. Take Leave the it. blade. Okay. Not fighting a monster without a blade. Even if it's not a very big one. Great. That mirror's back. Everyone's always on and on about the, the size of my blade. Me. What are you talking about? There is no mirror. It's just the stump and a narrow tunnel that leads to the basement. For how it's long us. I last feel the wind. It's telling in a fight. It's a hole in that wall. Our eyes deceive us. If that mirror's blocking our way, just smash it and be done with it. Uh, approach the mirror. I don't know what you're planning, but you're making my job a hell of a lot harder right now. Yeah, well, you know what? Sloppy, my job is hard. Every day, my job is hard. Uh, if you go on YouTube and type in Believer, uh, it's a song end of the beat of the rhythm sounds similar. Oh, okay. You step forward. I see. A small hole that leads to the basement, hesitating before you enter the princess's lair. You heard him. Stop hesitating and smash that antique. That mirror isn't part of this place. It's seeped through from somewhere else. It, if there even is an it, is a hallucination. Like you said, you've been here twice before. Your mind was bound to start playing tricks on you eventually. Okay. We went away after we reached out to it last time. Might as well try wiping it clean again. What's the arm? Uh, save the game and wipe it clean? Okay, I can do that. I can wipe all of our saves away. Uh, wipe the mirror. Reach forward and wave your hand over the open hole leading to the basement. See? Nothing. Tricks of the eye. 
No oh, I didn't see the coal down there. That's interesting. You step forward into the darkness. If there were one Ugh. stairs leading into the basement, there is nothing left to attest to their existence now. It smells of mold and decay. The damp walls leave streaks of dirt along your body as you're forced to hunch, then finally squat down on all fours in order to continue. Ugh. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. I hate that line. As you crawl forward on hands and knees, you're met only with the sounds of ambient earth. No voice slinks confidently up the stairs. This looks like the throat, yeah. Silence or pleads for safety. Don't love this part. Stay quiet. Don't give her a sound. <laughs> we have unfinished business. Uh, we should talk. We don't have to fight. I'm ready uh, to let you out of here. We don't have to fight. I'm ready to let you out of here. Say something, uh, say nothing, and move forward. Uh, this is like the perfect moment for like a small fart that just echoes down the hallway. Option number five. One, two, three, four, five. You say nothing, maintaining the silence as you carefully make your way down into the basement. The basement is dark and cavernous, a gaping maw threatening to swallow you whole. Oh, I don't no like that line. Here. Swallow Save you whole. Starlight has managed to filter down the tunnel. And though you can't see the vastness of the space, you can feel it. You're exposed. You're it exposed? You can't see down here. I'm not no exposed. I wear clothes. It would be better with a blade, but we'll make do. Also, you could also count the dots on the side of the words. Huh? Uh, stay quiet. Are we? Uh, we don't have to do this. Into the shadows, ready to fight. Step into the shadows and try to lure her out. On the side of the word. Oh, the little bullets. Uh, can you see if you're... Okay. Save game here? Okay. Gotcha! We've saved. What is this? Oh, that's like the little list of things. Oil effect. Oh, I love parallax. Parallax is the best. Uh, blinking CCT, CTC. Uh, one through four. Oh, uh, staying quiet, are we? We don't have to do this. Uh, step into the shadows, ready to fight. Step into the shadows and try to lure her out. We're basically going to pick all of them through the bottom. Oh, okay. She doesn't respond. I assume that means her answer is yes. Okay. You step into the shadows and are enveloped in total darkness. Your heart pounds in your chest, ears pricked, eyes wide despite the inky blackness, waiting for any sign of movement. There, she's about to strike. We're screwed. We can do this, even without a weapon. I'm no stranger to bloody fists. Uh, oh God! I forgot she makes that horrible noise. As the princess emerges, enormous more gaping, ready to swallow you whole. Oh, okay, I see. And oh, she just stops. Oh, okay, she's pulled in. I see. I think she did this last time. I think we've gotten this ending. 
She's going there's the... This, uh... Screw the mirror! We just need to find the prince! Gaze into the mirror! Go back to the other save? Okay. I'm back from animating. Uh, I'm not paying attention. Welcome back. Uh, I hope animating went well. I I hate doing that. And um, I couldn't. I couldn't. I just. It drives me crazy. <laughs> so uh, you probably have a lot more patience than I do. Option number two. She doesn't respond. It seems that she thinks you do, in fact, have to do this. Okay. Uh, step into the shadows, ready to fight. Step into the shadows and try to lure her out. Bum, 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 bum. Choo. You step into the shadows and are enveloped in total darkness. Your heart pounds in your chest, ears pricked, eyes wide despite the inky blackness. Wait, do we have ears? Sign of movement. Birds don't have ears. You're gonna turn around the second she runs for us. You'll get us killed, you pathetic fool. There, she's about to strike. With the near silence of a determined predator, the princess erupts from the shadows. But you've already stopped. Stop it! Fight her! Yeah, this is the one where she kills us, doesn't it? Of little consequence. Death. Again. Yeah. Okay. Birds have e birds don't have ears. It's impossible. She's gone. Birds can't hear. It's a. Uh, they use like the Should echolocation that they have like these little bulbs on their head uh, that send out sound waves, and that's how birds hunt. And there's that mirror again. Why is it here? Why now? Approach the mirror. This this doesn't feel that thing reeks of. Screw the mirror. We just. Google? No, no, no. Uh, you see, I'm an expert at birds. That's why um, I, I got my degree in birdology. Uh, or as the layman call it, ornithology. Uh, back to save again. Oh, okay. Step into the you shadow. Step into the shadows and are enveloped in total darkness. Your heart pounds in your chest, ears pricked, eyes wide despite the inky blackness. Wait there, she's about to strike. We're screwed. We can do this, even without a weapon. <laughs> shape of teeth and eyes. Wait. Uh, this seems to be the same one. Yeah, I think all of these kind of seem to just be the same uh, loop of... You step into the... What? There. She's about to... With the near silence of it. Stop it! The conflict in your heart, though usually of death. Of yeah, death. so it looks like all four of those options lead to, like, either death or her getting grabbed. She's gone. Where does she come? Uh, I'll pop back over here one more time just to be safe. Oh, uh, I don't know if I have one where we went to see the blade. Is this it? No. No. Load. Uh, yeah, I think we'll need to go back to the one where we got to the Den Beast. <gasps> Oops. Fuck. 
Um, I think I just overrode the save. Oh no. Oh crap. Shit. Um, Yeah, all right. I think that one's gone. What was this one? Uh, this is one where we had the blade, I think, and we had to choose between uh, getting eaten or uh, fighting her, so... Go back to top middle? Oh, yeah, that's it. Okay. Can I read them? Uh, what do you want? Stop hiding in the show yourself. Uh, I was sent to kill you or run for the stairs. Run for the stairs. All right. She's right there. We have, that's fair. She'll kill us if we try and run past her. Uh, I think the last time what we did was... I think we both fought her and ran for the stairs. Uh, what do you want? Stop hiding and show yourself. I was sent here to kill you because you're a threat to the world. I think this is the only one we didn't do. But I might be wrong. Option three. Oh, for the love of... You've given up the game. Great. All that will do is hasten her victory. So many useless thoughts run through your head. Thinking, thinking, thinking. You'll never hurt me if you keep thinking. She's coiling for another strike. Be somewhere else. We're on the back foot. The back foot keeps us nimble. Keeps us alive. It doesn't matter if it keeps us alive, if it eventually kills us. We need to take back the momentum. We need to do something. Um, how exactly are we supposed to take back the momentum here? Survive. Uh, wait for her to strike and hit her back. Play dead and stand still. We know play dead is not happening. We've learned our lesson. Option number two, survive. Barely moving out of the way before the princess surges past you with a speed that makes her practically unseen. Oh, I don't think I can keep this up. What do you want? Stop hiding and show yourself. You're deflecting. Or run for the stairs. Uh, yeah, that's play dead or stand still. Uh, that'll be fun. <laughs> yeah, I just I just can't stand being inside there again. Uh, what do you want? I want to swallow you whole, and I will get what I want. Uh, you have no exit. It doesn't work you out the way you no think. Hope. You live and die by my whims, and my whims alone. Don't ask her what she wants. Just slay her. Is that all the advice you have? Is there still no romance options yet? She looks like some specifics would be very helpful. She's just a princess. Don't overthink it. She is clearly not. Uh, I don't think I can keep this up. But why? Why do you want to kill me? Stop hiding and show yourself. You're deflecting. Run for the stairs. 
unfortunately, no. Stab. I see you over there with your, your beady eyes and your, your weird cat mouth. Uh, but if you're talking about this when they know, but other ones, yes. Number two. The kissing thing? Why does anything kill anything else? She needs to. That's I not didn't say I wanted to kill you. That is true. It sounds like she wants to do something even worse. What she wants only matters if she wins, and you're not going to let that happen. A tickling sensation rises at the base of your neck. Flee. We can't keep doing this. Uh, play dead! No! Uh, wait for her to strike and hit her back. Run for the stairs or stay alive. I'm assuming we're going to go for stay alive because we've done everything else, I think. We've killed so many. Ugh. Or maybe she's a little faster. You avoid her slavering jaws, but she manages to graze you, her titanic momentum skinning you along your side. Uh, romancing the princess on the other levels used to have... and got. It's like being sideswiped oh. by sandpaper. Ew! she that fast? She's kind of gross looking. I don't like her. You're bleeding now. Oh yeah? Well, you're ugly. You instinctively touch your side, testing her claim. It's wet, and stings from the gentle touch of your fingertips. I think I might just be a jellyfish. Both of those things describe a jellyfish. A costly mistake. We can't make it again. We will make it again unless something changes. We have to break the pattern. We need more time. She's cutting off our escape. Our game is nearing its end. I don't think I can keep this up. Okay, fine. Uh, why do you want to eat me? Stop hiding and show yourself. You're deflecting! Scave game here. Alright. We're all deflecting at this point. God, she's so creepy over there in the corner. You know, one of these days, princess, you're going to learn that uh, you're deflecting. You're and deflecting! You your weakness to the world. She's more tense this time. She means this next blow to be the last. The mere thought of moving again makes your bloodied side ache. We're exhausted. We're bleeding. We're still alive. We owe it to ourselves to move. Uh, alright, again. Wait for her to strike. Play dead or stand still. I think these two are off the table. Miss Princess, I don't like that you got a unicorn horn. That's mine. I want that. I'm gonna sell it. Once again, you know, you the full force of the impact, and once again, you are too slow to come away unscathed. You're starting to get tired. You're making mistakes. This isn't working. <laughs> Wouldn't we be the first time. Something. We have to figure out a plan. Don't plan ahead. Act on the now. All that matters is that we stay alive. We're trying, but we can't keep this up much longer. We have to. We keep up or we die. You're getting slow. Sorry, Kenneth, but I don't really like this princess. I'm not a huge fan of this one either, honestly. She seizes the opportunity, lunging once again from the darkness, fangs bared and claws flashing. She attacks over and over and over, and each time she leaves with a little piece of you. Too tired to think, but we have to think. We have to move. It's too late. Before you get the chance to react, it's over. Ugh. she makes her last foray from the dark corners of the room. 
unhinging her dripping maw, her eyes fierce and full of hope. Do your best to dive out of the way, and you partially succeed. Oh, did she rip us in half? Partially? Yes. The princess fails to swallow you whole. She only swallows your lower body. Oh. That's just as bad. That's worse, even. No, it's not worse, because we don't it's have to see the guts. At least this will be a faster end. You look down to see oh. the dirt between you is strewn with your intestines, oh. trailing all the way up and disappearing behind her. Oh, no! Teeth. My psychotic you tendency just kicked in! Scene. You start to go into shock. <laughs> I have to say it. We could have a moment like the, the dogs in the spaghetti scene where I'm sucking my intestines back into my body and she's sucking it into her mouth and we meet and we kiss. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's okay. I only like this one because it's one uh, as an animal. Uh, I'm more of a story person. Gross. Yeah, this is very gross. I'm sorry, Mr. Turtle. I did not know this would happen. I'm guessing you don't like this. Um... It's still better than getting swallowed whole. I, I can't stand... Uh, being ripped apart and eaten, it's it's horrifying and gross, but it doesn't trigger me the same way as Vor. The princess... Oh my god, she's... ...saliva dripping from her lips, idly gnaws on what's left of you as you rapidly <laughs> fade away. <laughs> Just close your eyes. Look, it's happening! We're gonna share the kiss! I didn't oh. know that. I still need to devour you, and it doesn't count if you're dead. I don't like her. I do not like this whole design. Like, she's trying to be we're too many animals. We're... Now we're but dead. But you don't have time to protest her premature observation of your death, because everything goes dark. And Thank God. The den. Oh, it starts back at the den. You're on a path in the wood. That didn't work. We're going in with the a plan this skeptic. Time. Why does he sound so much like the loop, stubborn? Just acting on instinct. We're stuck in a big enough loop as it is. Instinct was keeping us alive until it wasn't. So what are we supposed to do? Great. So you've been here before. That doesn't bode well. You're not supposed to have been here before. This is supposed to be one and done. So you know more than you're letting on. Yeah, what he said. Of course I do, but believe me, it's in your best interests. The more you know about the princess, the more difficult your task will be. Oh, we have someone new. Uh, I like the skeptic. <laughs> I haven't heard the skeptic yet, I don't think. Why is that? He kind of makes me think of a combination of, like, the, the paranoid uh, with the, the vo vocal habits of the, uh... What what is uh, the stubborn? Letting me explain why would defeat the whole purpose. There are simply some things I'm not allowed to tell you. It's a hard rule. See, he, but he keeps Who's changing that. It? Who's telling you to boss us around? We've died twice already, and if you want us to stay alive this time, it's in your best interests. We only heard them edge. in the razor. Oh, did we hear them in the razor? It's my rule, and this conversation is over. See, I mean, I guess, I guess I'm think I'm looking too much into it. We already kind of know his whole deal. We kind of know what the narrator's hiding from us. Okay, what's the plan? The path is different than it was before. I want answers. What is going on here? What do you know that you're not telling me? What if we just leave? Uh, no matter what happens next, it seems like our answers are in the cabin. Proceed to the cabin. I'm done. In the razor, in the same ending as the empty cup and no way out. Right. I, I just don't remember the skeptic. I, I get too excited when the contrarian shows up, so all the other voices are just completely dead to me. <laughs> One. She spent as much time as she could in the shadows, so we're going to draw her out. Okay, didn't we already do that? But we're clever too. So this time we're not going to let her cut off our escape. We're going to lead her to the stairs ourselves. Okay, we also did that. It's easier to deal with her once we can actually see what she is. But you already know what she is. She's a princess. Yeah, You're a princess. Right. A 
princess we couldn't see, and one that had big, sharp teeth, too. How about you stick to describing things, and we'll stick to doing our job? Sharp teeth. Path is diff- Path is diff- went. Uh, I want answers. Uh, what if we just leave, no matter what, proceed to the cabin, silently proceed to the cabin, or I'm done with this. Bye! Uh, that was stubborn. This is skeptic. This will be different. I think it would be the same, but with a different voice. <laughs> I would absolutely love this whole entire route to just be suddenly Lion King <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> the princess just did a 180. Silently proceed to the cabin. Uh, it's in the circle of life. Yep, that's that's my goal. And a baboon like holds her up and just flings her. Uh, because I was looking at the wiki, it says it's the same. Silently proceeded to cabin. Okay. Well, we'll give it a shot. You I, 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 down to the cabin. I'm the feeling like a lot of these are just rates. kind of like all you dead ends to do. on this route. All right, we've been over the plan. Goad her out of the shadows. Make her show herself. And what if she doesn't want to be seen? We'll figure out a way to make it happen. And if that doesn't make her any easier to fight, it will. It's always easier to fight what you can see, no matter how big or toothy she might be. Okay. Uh, is dark and overgrown. Yes, I love that meme with the baboon. I love that. So much it's good. That had you not seen the exterior... You might not have noticed this was a cabin at all. The only furniture of note, if you could call it that, is a knotted stump, a pristine blade embedded in its exposed rings. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you're going to do this right. Of course that damn mirror's back, and of course he's not saying anything about it. Why is it following us? What are you talking about? There is no mirror. It's just the stump and a narrow tunnel that leads to the basement. He isn't tricking us. Can you feel the wind? It, then either way, we need to investigate. Might as well get started. Um, all right. Uh, this one will be the cannon ending for this one. Take the blade and then wipe the mirror clean. Okay. Yes, take the steel claw. You pull the blade from the stump, gripping it tight. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the odds are we'll need it. Thanks for not putting us in a bad spot. You're welcome. Actually, you know what? You step forward. I'm, I'm, I like how polite you were. The basement, hesitating before you enter the princess's lair. Haven't you been paying attention? We're not hesitating. This supposed hole is blocked by that old mirror. That mirror isn't part of this place. It's seeped through from somewhere else. It, if there even is an it, is a hallucination. Like it went away after we reached out to it last time. Okay, you wipe the mirror. Oh, yeah, we can't even smash it this time. That's nice. The basement. See, nothing. Tricks of the eye. No one sense can be trusted on its own. You step forward into the darkness. If there were once stairs leading into the basement, there is nothing left to attest to their existence now. There is only a long tunnel of packed earth. It smells of mold and decay. The damp walls leave streaks. You know what? No, I'm not listening to your line again. And knees, you're met only with the sounds of ambient earth. No voice slinks confidently up the stairs. No entity threatens violence or pleads for safety. Stay quiet. Don't give her a sound. Once again, the perfect moment for a perfectly executed fart. Um, all right. We have unfinished business. We should talk. Uh, we don't have to fight. I'm ready to let you out of here. Uh, we could lie, or we could say nothing and silent purely proceed. Uh, Fred Mayer is a part for the narrator. Stay quiet. Okay. 
You say nothing. Maintaining the side of the basement is dark and cavernous, a gaping moor threatening to swallow you whole. There is no light here, save for what little starlight has managed to filter down the tunnel. And though you can't see the vastness of the space, you can feel it. You're exposed. Stay on your toes. We take a step into the shadows, and as soon as she moves, we jump back, make her follow. From there, we trap her in the tunnel, draw her out of the cabin, whatever it takes to get her out of her element. Uh, staying quiet, are we? We don't have to do this. Step into the shadows, ready to fight. Step into the shadows and try to lure her out. Uh, the mirror is part of the narrator. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, he's like that. Sh he's like shattered mirror at the end. I think because we keep because we keep fucking with him. Uh, number four. Step into the shadows and try to lure her. The shadows and are enveloped in total darkness. Your heart pounds in your chest, ears pricked, eyes wide, despite the inky blackness, waiting for any sign of movement. That's right. Keep steady. Don't let your nerves get the better of you. There. She's about to strike. No, she's not. I dare her. In the near silence of a determined predator, the princess erupts from the shadows. But you've already started your swift escape. That's stage one. Now stay focused. You dive into the tunnel and begin scrambling up towards the cabin. You hear her behind you, claws raking at the dirt, chains rattling, breaths hot and heavy with the effort of the ascent. But the sounds are coming slower now. Oh. The breaths pained and stuttering. You no longer sense frantic motion behind you in the tunnel. You risk a glance. She is a broad and sickly creature. Oh. A withered and emaciated flesh clinging to bones too large to fit in the narrow space. She managed to squirm her way into the tunnel in pursuit, but now she's stuck, incapable of either moving towards you or returning to the open darkness of the basement below. So that's what she's become. She wasn't like this when we started. Was she? Yes. No, she wasn't. Looking at her makes me feel... sad. Yeah. Yeah. Now that we can see her, she doesn't feel like much of a threat at all. Her eyes look up at yours. Wide. Pleading. Come back. You can imagine them saying, mm, "Hang on, Don't leave me here." But you shouldn't listen to the sad eyes of a vanquished enemy. She wants nothing more than to change places with you. I've got a plot hole here. In the one where she eats us, how the hell did she get out to the door? If you want us to ignore her, then why would you tell us any of that wide, pleasing eyes begging for mercy <laughs> business to begin with? All it does is make us feel conflicted. I'm merely describing things as they are. It's not my fault that her eyes had something to say, even if that something was a ploy, which, if I might stress, I pointed out to you. What should we do about her anyway? Can she still end the world like this? She hurts. We should help. Oh, the hunt is... Okay. We did bring the blade. Maybe we should use it. Splendid idea. You have a job to finish, and this is the perfect opportunity. Or maybe we should try and talk to her. Oh. <laughs> That's a terrible idea. Your first one was better. Let's talk. Slay the princess. Uh, see, this is different. Because there were stairs in the hole. It was bigger. It wasn't a tunnel. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to talk to her. You cautiously make your way closer to the princess, her eyes avoiding yours with the silent resignation of a defeated predator. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't matter. She's gone. And there's that mirror again. What is that supposed to mean? Whatever awful thing. Death. No. That can't be right. There has to be something. There was never anything more. Death is death.
Uh, glaze into the mirror. Wait, ga gaze into the mirror. And we have withered. You find yourself in the long quiet once again. Proceed to the cabin. Guess you're right. This, uh, that is different. The wiki is unfinished, sadly. Uh, can you go back, please? Or are you checking out what she has to say? I'm going to check and see what she says on this. Ooh, uh uh, that's disgusting. This form shouldn't have existed. A growing chorus of contradiction. A mass. All of me is changing, and yet the rest of me is still the same. Uh, what do you think of this vessel? This one is consumed by instinct. A predator pushing those around her to adapt. She will make for a bold heart. You know what? I don't even think I want this one to be part she of your heart. She to devour you. To make you a part of myself. But she is only a voice. Do not mourn her. I don't. she is part of something greater. I don't mourn this one. All right, we'll go back and we'll stab her. All right, slay the princess. You tighten your grip around the blade and cautiously approach the princess. She eyes you with the silent resignation of someone or something. Oh, I don't. This one feels bad. You lift the weapon over your head, preparing a lethal blow. Just one strike, and the entire world will owe you a debt of gratitude. Okay, yeah, okay. It just grabs her anyway. Uh, well, it's going to be the cannon for now. That just kind of felt cruel. She's gone, and there's... This, uh, you're... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We've heard all this before. Like a thousand times, guys. Once again, we're in the proceed. Approach her. I'll see what she has to say about this one. Just to be safe, it doesn't. She doesn't say anything else. She seems to only have like the same thing about the vessel that we bring her on these. This one is consumed by instinct. A predator pushing those around her to adapt. She will make for a bold. This one should not be the cannon. Should be the other one. Ah, it's fine. We'll we'll keep she this one. She me to devour you. To me, do not mourn her, for she is part of something greater. I'm ready to go back. I will be here when it is time for us to meet again. Cool. Uh, bring the din to her. The dindum. <laughs> You're on a path in the woods. You're here to slay her. Killing the princess seems kind of bad. Blah, 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 blah. All right, you can ask your questions now. My questions? Did I have questions? So before we go any farther, would you like me to tell you what happened to the princess swallows you whole and leaves uh, the cabin? Yeah, go for it. I, I feel like it's probably kind of like a similar thing that uh, the other happy on those happy endings where we just get sucked in. But uh, go for it. Because I don't think that the uh, the shifting mound will let us leave with anything in the end. Uh, to Kenneth, I won't read that. Basically, she leaves the cabin, then she splits you back out. Then you can see her sitting down, and she gets grabbed by the grabby hands. 
And if you choose to stab her in the belly and stabbed her in the heart, then you get the root ending. It's the wild. Okay. The one where she becomes like fused to the tree. Okay. That kind of checks out. I need to make an avatar that's a plant. I mean, we have the mushroom, but we need like we need like a brambly plant avatar. I'm going to make a note of that real quick. <laughs> While I'm thinking of it. Cool. Okay, cool. Uh, so do you guys have any other endings that you want us to go for on this run? Uh, do I get some sort of reward? Uh, last time I found a dinosaur that was translucent. Um, oh, are you talking about the avatars? Uh, that was the, actually the mushroom. That was uh, the mushroom. I had to fix it, though, uh, though I figured out how to change it back. Um, which uh, I'll just change myself real quick over to it. Uh, it is now the mushroom bioluminescent skin. And I will. As far as a translucent dinosaur, I don't think I have a I don't think I have a palette like that one yet, but we can add some. No, I found a dinosaur. OK, uh, let me let me just post that link again real quick. You can go check it out. Uh, the dinosaur hasn't changed any, so it should still be there if it is, if if it's uh uh did I post that? <laughs> Sorry, yeah, there we go. Uh, may I change my skin? And I know a couple more endings. Don't worry. Okay. Oh, pardon me. We are all of a sudden. Ooh. Uh, so I was talking with um, Mr. Bisto the other day. Uh, we may at some point in the future do a collaboration with a game that we are going to try. Uh, I don't know when that's going to happen, but just a heads up. Uh, at some point in the near future, near-ish future, I have no idea when. We didn't set anything beyond an initial plan, but uh, we'll do like a collab with them. So hopefully that'll be fun. As well, I have a couple other games that I'd like to see about doing in the future. Um, if anyone here is a fan of Final Fantasy, I would uh, like to consider doing Final Fantasy IX at some point, uh, which is absolutely my favorite Uh one it's uh oh no yeah that's not supposed to be like that <laughs> is that root beer uh yeah oh wait no that's not right that's green Oh, it looks like that. Uh, that it looks like that uh, piece is broken. Not entirely sure, but um, I, there was another game that I had. Let me just take a look while we're while we're waiting. That I thought would be some real fun stuff. Um, What's broken? Um, I think you one of your uh, costume pieces is broken. Uh, you should not be green. <laughs> As you have stopped being animated. So I'll have to fix that later. Oh, God. Where, where, where did Steam go? Library. Trying to remember what that game was.
Uh, and we need to continue Silent Town at some point if it, if everyone's interested in that. Uh, there's also a couple other games. So for most of you guys, I don't think any of you guys were watching. I think many of you probably joined more recent. Uh, whenever I first brought back this channel, I had started doing Digimon Survive. Which... I've been thinking about bringing that back. It's just, it's got such a grim storyline and it started to get into like abuse territory. And I just, it made me feel bad. So uh, I'm considering maybe doing that one again in the future, pulling that one back out. But for now, but for now we'll, we'll keep going through the uh, old princess. There we go. Uh, so, yeah. Um, but, yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for the future, if you guys have any games that are just great, I do I do enjoy a good, sad story. That's also... That's also fun. Um, but you can always leave me comments, uh, send me messages through the Discord, through the email, whatever, whatever strikes your fancy or the chat. Usually I miss the chat <laughs> sometimes. So, uh, but, yeah. Um... Oh dear. I broke something. Hmm. Sorry, I broke the stream a little bit on my end. You guys can probably still see everything. Studio. Oh no. Uh, how did I break that? Uh sorry, chat. I, I don't really have a princess right now. I'm I'm like looking at the wiki and I didn't find anything interesting. Uh yeah, the dinosaurs are kind of broken, but that's okay. Yeah, the dinosaur one was one of the first ones I made. Uh so I was still kind of learning how to do it. I think my hat piece is broken too. Yeah, uh, unfortunately, the dinosaur, because of, like, the size and scale of it, it kind of messes up. Am I supposed to be transparent? Yes. Uh, as for Kenneth, some of the skins in here are as well. Uh, that was a bug that we decided to make a feature. Uh, myself, uh, yes, I am actually meant to be transparent. Uh, it took me a very long time to get that to work. <laughs> Uh, I can name a few princesses we can do right now if you want. Uh, sure. Actually, what, I, what I'm thinking we might do is um, let's go in for a blind one. I, I'm just going to kind of go with my options. Uh, feel free to chime in if you guys have anything you think I should do on this route. But uh, I think what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of go in blind. Uh, that way, you know, it's kind of more surprising. Uh, and I think, I think personally one that I want to see kind of now is, uh, the one we did the first time. Um, the world's ending. Uh, maybe I'm okay with the world ending. Why would I even consider that? Nobody wants the world to end. I mean, maybe some people do, like nihilists or very, very evil people but surely you're not one of those right yeah maybe uh if we get one of the same should we direct you in a different course uh sure yeah are you talking about the nightmare um i don't remember was it the nightmare oh wait we did do the ray thing didn't we okay well we'll, we'll just kind of we'll wow, just kind of wing it the mental exercise we are running up against a bit of nevertheless 
let me assure you, and before you decide to waste even more of our time by asking how I know that, let me suggest a more pragmatic lens through which to view this situation. Causality doesn't matter here, because the end result is the same no matter what led us up to this point. <coughs> if the princess leaves the cabin, the world will end, and there is no changing that. Uh, the nightmare's different to the wraith. Oh, okay. Well, we, we might get it then. We might we might go for that one. It's no use arguing semantics over a metaphorical chicken or egg, because the egg is hatched and it's about to ruin everything. Unless, of course, you do your job and slay her. I'm thinking that this time, okay, thanks for telling me what to do. <laughs> it's all part of the job. You make your way. A warning. She will lie. We're not going to go ignore him. All right, we've heard we've heard all these voice lines of blah a ton already. So, the um, interior of the cabin is the blade is your. Imp uh, here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we enter the basement without the blade. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase faintly illuminated by. Doing her voice. your favor. Oh my god, I hate that. <laughs> it's hypnotizing. Don't let it fool you. Uh, hey, I think you, I'm here to test slay you. You must have the wrong address. Oh my god, that's such a good... Great job, you've given away the element of surprise. Okay. Good luck, hero. Uh, the nightmare is different than the wraith. Uh, we've done that one too many... We've done that one one too many times. You walk down the stairs and lock eyes with the princess. There's a heavy chain around her wrist. Binding. She's. I am begging you to stay focused. There's a lot riding on you here. Hi. You were joking about coming <laughs> to kill me, right? Do, do you think you could get me out of these chains? Examine the chains. Uh, let's talk about. It. Let's talk a bit first. Okay. I think most of these options are kind of things we've seen before, but I think we've seen most of everything. I don't remember how many princesses we've done. Um, okay, I'm going to get you out of here. Examine the chains. Oh. Have we just left her here? I'm going to keep you walked away down here, at least for a little while. If I'm the first person you've seen, what have you been eating and drinking? That's just, that's such a good question, right? I, I, I'm going to go with, um... Oh, when we enter without the blade? Um, yeah, I mean... I feel like... There's, like, only two options, so a lot... We've done a lot of them. Both ways, and I don't... Uh, maybe then everyone could be happy. That seems like a pretty good compromise. So you weren't kidding on the stairs? I thought you were just making- Leaving her alive is too risky. So I'm the only one who liked that idea. <laughs> yeah. One way or another, I'm going- But if you don't, I can promise that you'll regret that decision. You have to make a choice. Locker in the basement. I think we've done this, though. I know you think this is some kind of fair compromise, but it isn't. No one wins here. It's a chance we'll have to take. We can make this work if we just stay here and keep watch. No one has to die. Uh, I'm talking about entering the basement. Yeah, you never done that one. Only the first one. Uh, but you just kept going away. Okay, yeah, and we went to the, the long quiet. Her text normally white, but then it goes pink and then red when she's mad. Huh. Where are you going? You can't just... You turn your back to the princess and make your way back. Oh, wait, he locks us out, doesn't he? Turn your back on me, but it won't be long before I slip these chains. And once I'm out of here, there will be hell to pay for leaving me behind. Slip these chains? She can't, right? She needed our help to get out of here. But do you hear the conviction in her voice? I don't think she's bluffing. Either way, she dropped the mask, didn't she? You can still grab the blade and get back down here. Nope, we're sticking to the plan. All of us, but fine. Okay, so he's actually gonna let us leave. 
Okay, that's you close the best. Oh door, yeah, this is the one where we get like the, it with the heavy she just table that kills us. Okay. Oops, sorry. I'm pushing wall, buttons too quickly. Reach the basement door. It isn't long before you start to drift off. Your eyelids heavy with fatigue, but sleep doesn't come. Instead, your rest is broken by a piercing, wailing voice calling out to you from the other side of the door. All right, this is it. Oh, you're still there. Why don't you make things easier on yourself and let me out? It's not like this little door I'll hold for very long anyway. Um, it's probably a good idea to try to get back on my good side. She sounds terrified. <laughs> She's less of the princess you saw and more like something out of a nightmare. As she violently rattles the door, you do your best to shut her out of your mind. When I get out of here... I'm going to pick you apart piece by piece. Where's the blade? I'll what you did, and I'll never forgive it. You won't know the kind of enemy you've made tonight. It doesn't sound like she's getting any weaker. Uh... All right, this is a white. Uh, what what is this one? I think this is one uh, that I got the very first time I played this uh, as the recording, uh, the nightmare. No, it doesn't. Uh, threaten me all you like, all you want. All it does is ease my guilty conscience. So uh, all of that was just an act, wasn't it? You're not really innocent or harmless. You're not even a princess. You're a monster. Oh, I think we did this one, ignore her and go into sleep the first time. I could be innocent and harmless if I want to be. Teasing me with fresh air and a chance to fire me with freely doesn't inspire me to play nice. Oh. You put the princess's threats out of your mind as best you can and huddle up against the wall. Uh... The nightmare. Yes, the par. Oh, were you getting the paranoid? Oh, you know what? We may have gotten the paranoid the first time. Number two. Sorry, I picked number. S oh, I did pick number two, didn't I? You jolt awake in the middle of the night to silence in the cabin. The ruckus has stopped, and the door to the basement is ajar. It's locked. No, it's a door. And the table shoved out of the way. I think I made that same joke. Where is she? Predictable. Thanks for helping me get out of that awful basement. This is different. Okay, this is different than the one I got. Or I did. The one I did, she was like... You try oh, maybe it's not, maybe not. Feet, but as the princess draws near, it's as though your body simply stops working. Okay, it is the same one. Okay. Uh, by the way, the hinges are just broken. They don't open like that. What? IB, I is back. Welcome back, Cryo. Uh, we are just kind of doing like a random. Well, I wouldn't say a random run. I'm just kind of doing my own deal here, uh, trying to get whatever. It isn't all at once. The paralysis comes in waves. First, your toes go numb, and then your feet, and then your legs. Jokes on you! I already can't feel you my lie feet. Prone on the floor of the cabin, unable to do anything but witness her approach. Whose side are you on? <laughs> Yours, of course. But I have a duty to uphold the truth. Lying about the facts of the situation doesn't change them. It could. But you do have an influence. So we already know that. Helpless. I can take my time with you, can't I? She steps closer, one silent footfall at a time, cocking her head in curiosity as uh. you feel your organs shutting down one by one. Or maybe... Oh, God. I, can't take my time I forgot you. about this. You don't look well. A little green around the gills. I don't have gills. Birds don't have gills. A shame. If you'd only help me get out of here, we could have done such wonderful things together. I know. I've experienced them. Stop drawing in breath, and your heart freezes in your chest. You have seconds left. You know, though, with a little, a little, uh, TLC, I think, I think she could look pretty beautiful. I'd say better luck next time. 
but we both know this is the end, don't we? Yeah, except I know we're different. Can't this can't actually be how everything ends. I'm sorry, but it is. Everything goes dark, and you die. <laughs> uh, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Stay where you are. At, don't press nothing. Thank you. I'm excited. Same. Uh, what's up, Cryo? How you doing? How you doing? The Nightmare. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. You're here to slay her. If All right, um let's see here. I'm going to I'm going to initiate something new for you guys. Uh Welcome back. Uh I'm just real quickly I'm going to make you guys all fight because I think that would be funny. And I like having the power of uh <laughs> controlling you. I just have to pull up the command. <laughs> Look at this. And go. Kill each other. Dang, we're fighting. Yep, we're 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 gonna Fortnite this. Oh God, who let Torbot in? He's not supposed to be here. Why am I here? I don't want to kill you guys. I want you guys to kill each other. <laughs> uh, this is just a little deal. Um, Basically, it's kind of like a battle royale type of deal here. No, don't pick up the fucking health pack. Oh my god, I do not need to be winning this. I think Kenneth just looks like he's ahead. He's going for that health pack. Uh, this is basically just a little battle royale game. Uh, you guys don't really do anything here. It's just kind of... I'm dead. Yeah. Um, Kenneth, you probably should have received... Oh, you got a little emote. It's nice. Uh, but yeah, it's just a fun little deal um, that we can initiate whenever. Uh, it also gives you points if you win. And uh, I think you get you should have gotten a loot box. However, I think everybody's already unlocked everything from that. So you probably just got coins. Yeah. Money. Nice. <laughs> you got money. Uh, as everyone should already have all the burb items. But that was just a fun little thing. We'll we'll probably be doing a few more of those in the future whenever I start actually locking gear behind uh, events. Things like that. Uh, it's similar to the boss battle, except you guys don't have to do anything. Uh, there's also the slot machine. If you guys want to play the slots, just type exclamation point slots and space, and then how much you want to bet. Uh, let's get back over to the game now. All right, so uh, we are back here on the beginning of the path. Um, I don't see there being any way to not get a new ending here. Unless we turn around and leave. Uh, she's going to kill me again. Again? People don't die twice. You haven't even met the princess, and I hardly think she'd be capable of killing someone as skilled and courageous as yourself. Oh. If he doesn't remember what happened, then maybe it's best to keep it that way. Shh. What if he hears us? That's a very good question, little voice. <laughs> what if he does hear you? Shit. 
<laughs> I do remember this guy. Yeah, I think you'll okay. Find ourselves very hard pressed to keep any secrets. Paranoid, maybe number two. Not that it matters right now because, like I said, this is the first time we've met. Still, I'd rather not get off on the wrong foot. We've a world to save, after all. Uh, I'm happy the paranoid is here. Yeah, I am too. I'm extremely excited. Uh, uh, the only way it could be better if we also got the contrarian. Uh, let's assume I'm telling the truth. Proceed to the cabin. Turn around. Uh, I think we have to proceed. A warning. She will lie. I don't think... It doesn't matter. Don't trust. Don't trust anyone. The interior of the cabin is plain, oh. the smooth wood of the walls almost featureless. The only furniture of note is a lone table, not oh. inside in the corner of the room. What the, the fuck? stands between you and the open, inviting basement doorway. Okay, that- uh, can everyone else see that? There are, like, people, like, shadow people outside the windows. Yeah, that's so upsetting. <laughs> One of my favorite lines. Uh, look out the windows, yeah. Uh, there's ghosts and eyeballs out the window. See, I thought, I thought that was, like, some kind of weird watermark at first. I was like, wait a minute. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you want to do this right. Hold on. What happened to the door? There was a door here last time. Oh, that is kind of upsetting. It's just an empty frame. She's already got now, hasn't she? And she's ready for us. She's been waiting. Can't you feel her eyes on us? Yes, I actually can. I'm going to need all of you to pull yourselves together. The princess has not already gotten out. But if you keep getting stuck in your head like this, you're going to struggle to get the job done. Uh, there's ghosts and windows. I've seen all the princesses and endings. It's not that scary, but for you, who knows? I mean, they, this game doesn't do a super great job about doing like jump scares because it's kind of like frame by frame. But so deep breath in. Sometimes deep it can get me. Out. I think I think awaits, way more than it should. Do it. Okay, this is whole cabin is different. Uh, approach the mirror. Take the blade into the basement. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do a save here. We'll do both. Uh, take the blade for you first. Reach down and pick the blade up off the floor. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. Um, by the way, do you like my car? No horns? Take the blade? Car no horns? Oh, car no horns! Uh, yeah, uh, that is specifically, I added those in. Uh, I need to add some palettes to it so you can get some other Steel colors, but yeah. Lie to us. That is you not true. Gonna be enough, though. Couldn't you have given us something else? Something, I don't know. Better than a knife? Could we have a bomb? Uh, but how are you gonna kill her if she looks like a ghost? Uh, a carnotaurus. I'm not sure if we can. Uh, I was just hoping if we go in without the blade, we get like a happy ending that we could make like part blade of the main the run. Anything you need to finish your task. You're more than capable of pulling this off, so long as you don't lose faith. Those are the words of someone who knows he's sending us to our death. Paranoid, you are speaking my language. Uh, you didn't say anything about the mirror. The whole cabin's different than I remember it being. Approach the mirror into the basement. Uh, what about the you gun? Can the we threshold. have a bazooka a or a gun? Steps. Suspended oh, dogs. fuck. Okay, uh, I'll be right back to the scene. Um, we can add that stuff. It won't be functional because that's just not really 
part of the Steam Avatar thing. Um, but yeah, I can I can add like weapons and stuff to the Avatar list. Uh, just little things that you can add to your Avatar. So uh, once again, it won't be functional. It'll all be cas uh, cosmetics. Um, this, though, I... Wow, <laughs> this is creepy. This this really does embody um, paranoia. I, I went to college with somebody who had, like, their motif was, like, eyes and stuff. I went to an art college, by the way, so if anyone is worried about wondering why that was a thing, um, I got a degree in arts. But their, their motif was, like, eyes and, uh, like paranoia and stuff and that, that was such a cool theme i'm guessing you're going to be picking all the, the, the things all i can think of is the stair scene of spirited away i don't remember anything from spirited away um the princess is why the paranoid's my favorite oh look more eyes <laughs> uh yeah i'll kind of be if, feel free if 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 i'm making a bad choice here feel free to chime in more uh eyes. we're just kind of doing this as i go eyes. <laughs> the air seeping up from below reminds you of fresh lightning and static, as if you're descending into a place that isn't meant for a creature of flesh and blood. If the, her cruel oh, and playful voice prances up the stairs. Prances up the stairs, that's a nice way to say it. I didn't think you'd come back. We're gonna have a lot of fun, you and I. Okay, we need a game plan. Last time we were here, just being close to her was enough to kill us. We're gonna flirt. Um, how hard is it to? Th <laughs> I like that one. Uh, I'm going to talk to her. Uh, we need to plan. I'm just going to kill her. Mr. Narrator seems to think I can do it. I don't know why you're all being such pessimists right now. Step off into the void between the stairs. Continue down the stairs in silo. <laughs> Why is this an option? I like both of those. Uh, why one? Okay, we're going with one. I do like that. How hard is it to Can't throw a knife? Hard. But then we'd lose our weapon. We'd have to make it count. Otherwise she'd be furious and we'd be defenseless. If a knife is even enough to do anything against something like her in the first place. It'll be enough. Uh, I'm going to talk to her. <laughs> we don't need a plan. I'm just going to do it. Step off the void into the stairs. I don't know why. That sounds so tempting. Like, we're going to, like, slow fall. Step into the void? Okay. Yeah, we'll do it. I'm, I'm into that. You oh. attempt to step off the stairs and into the pitch black surrounding them, but you're stopped by an invisible force. Why did you do that? What did you think would happen? I thought I'd get to free fall. I was curious, honestly. I don't know, falling into infinite void seemed better than going downstairs. Okay, uh... Uh... I'm just scared. I was curious, honestly. Really lucked out. Of all the things that could have happened from stepping into a void, nothing is quite possibly the best outcome you could have gotten. I don't know, man. You make your way to the bottom of the stairs. I feel like we're pissing him off. Oh, three, one. Oh, sorry. Two. Oh, God. So many. As you emerge, oh, you God. find yourself between two loose rows of white wooden planks suspended in nothingness. A smattering of cobblestones visible against the inky black the of the basement mark where the floor should be, forming vague pathways. At what seems to be the end of the room, they diverge in opposite directions, left and right. Okay, I'm going to say left has the princess. She could be anywhere, and there's nowhere for us to hide. We're completely exposed. Are you really not going to comment on how weird this place is? No, I'm not. <laughs> Somebody needs to be the voice of reason here, and it certainly isn't you. Well, screw you. Excuse me. I'm being incredibly reasonable. You're the one who's just matter-of-factly describing whatever the hell we're looking at like it's an ordinary basement. I'm going to die down here. I don't want to die again. Oh. Please stop saying that. You're only going to make things worse. Just pick a direction and start moving. I wouldn't give it too much thought if I were you. It doesn't really matter. Because either way you go, 
I'm going to find you. Go left, go right, do nothing, go back the way you came. <laughs> Turn around. Sound. Oh, is there no sound? Shit. Uh, I'm not sure why there's no sound for you. Oh, you can't. Okay, okay. Okay, good. Um, there might be a problem on the receiving end, I'm afraid, in that case. Uh, four, turn around. All right. You turn back to the stairs, oh. only to find that they aren't there. A faintly outlined path lies before you. There you are. Oh! I told you I was going that's to not pleasant. You. As the princess approaches. Oh, actually, she's not as bad as I thought. You go numb. Your arms quickly follow. She is kind of pretty, yeah. Uh, she's she's it's, she's got that doll face, it, isn't it? I can brought a little knife with you. Cute. Oh. There has to be a way out of this. Think, think. Wait, where's the flirt Don't option? You. Pull yourself together. She isn't supposed to be like this. I wonder how many times I'll get to play with you before you break. Three. Oh Your shit. Blood begins to coagulate. It's as if every part of your being is coming to a lurching halt. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. I was just going to let him keep going, Heart. but... Your okay. lungs pull in oh. a desperate gulp of nerves. air as your eyes shoot back open. Lungs. Oh. Liver. She's going to keep us what coming back and down. I'm working. Do you want this body to function? Oh. Do you want and then experience oh. stops once more as your body reapproaches death. Okay, whatever you were doing, please just start doing it. Oh, he's keeping us alive? Okay. Uh, she is pretty. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. My favorite line. <laughs> it, it almost sounds like a uh, uh, kind of like a song or something like a uh, cat food commercial. Uh, this is my favorite part when the paranoid says, "Oh yeah, <laughs> he's he's pretty good at keeping us alive." Sure Are you sure that's what you want, or do you want to interrupt me some more? <laughs> you have seconds left. Yes, I'm sure. Heart, lungs, liver. Nerves, heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Again, your eyes Ooh. shoot open as you gasp for breath. Liver, nerves. Can't decide what you want to do, can you? Liver. Well, I was hoping for to go for like the the romantic, but she isn't attacking us. Why? I think she's into us. <laughs> Heart, lungs, liver, nerves. Uh, my earbuds were... Okay, cool. Okay. I was going to say, everyone else is so far, so I'm going to assume it wasn't me. Don't lose sight of your mission. Heart, lungs, But I've, I have internet problems, so... Your weapon is still in your hands. Strike at her and end this before it's too late. Uh, why won't you finish me off? Uh, what's good am I to alive? What do you want from me? What happened after you killed me? Uh, I was sent here to stop you from destroying the world. I can't just let you leave. Uh, you're a lunatic. You know that, right? Uh, if you want to work together, can you at least turn off this whole organs shutting off situation? Uh, how about I just kill you instead? Uh, why don't... We don't have to be enemies. We can work together. We could be friends even. I'm not doing any of this. I'm not helping you leave, and I'm not going to kill you. 
toss the blade and remain with your nightmare. Okay, let's get out of here. Fine, you win. I'll let you leave. Leave together. Run or slay the princess. Uh. Oh, uh, save the game here. Okay. Why won't you finish me off? I don't want to. And even if I did, I don't have to. Oh, okay. Look at the way you're struggling to stay alive. It's taking everything you have to keep your heart pumping right now. And I'm enjoying the show. She's so sassy. The princess leans forward, bringing her mask lips close to your ear. If I want to see oh. you die, all I need to do is break your concentration. Heart, lungs, liver, nerves, heart, lungs. She slowly runs her velvet glove oh. across the base of your neck. It feels like static. And then... Shit, shit, make her stop. Hey, snap out of it. Okay, deep breath. Deep breath, we're fine. Heart, your back. Lungs, liver, wow. Nerves, heart, lungs, One moment, liver, and nerves, then you're heart, gone. Lungs, liver, Just nerves, like heart. That. Liver, ah, nerves, and there's the fear. I'm not afraid of you. Liver, but that wouldn't be very fun, now would it? I've already done that. Lungs, liver, nerves, heart, what happened after he killed you? I want. Oh, uh. The paranoid is helping us here. Yeah, I, I, I'm surprised how helpful the paranoid actually is. Yeah, I know she can't help. Uh, you're a lunatic, you know that, right? I'm what I am. And right now, I'm in control. So, you might want to be a little nicer than me. Okay. She raises one long gloved finger, its tip hovering just over your skin, seeming to enjoy the lingering threat. But she withdraws, sparing you another momentary glimpse of death. Uh, how about I just kill you instead? We don't have the enemies. What happens if we toss the blade to the side? I kind of want to see what happens. Are you serious? Yeah. Nobody's happy here, but maybe it's for the best. You poor deluded thing. Oh. Do you think a single moment of bravery changes you into something you're not? What's that brave? And you're always going to be a coward. She raises a hand to her mask and pulls it down. Oh, no! You don't get the chance to see what lies beneath before it envelops you. Like a creeping mold, the complete reality of your existence threads its way through your mind. Birth. Death. Birth again. Decay and bloom. A million stitches from a million microscopic what the fuck? wounds you've inflicted on everyone you've ever met, with every muscle you've moved and every word you've ever spoken. No, 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 no. Let me out. Your existence hurts them. Let me out. A lonely soul in a room by itself, weeping. It lives for 80 years and then it's gone. What the fuck is it's there again? Let me out. A reprieve. A good life. Love. Children. A steady career. Recognition from your peers. Here one moment. Gone the next. The worms have found their orifices. What, what the fuck? Uh, sorry, he can help. Oh, you made a big mistake. Oh, no, not this. Listen, if I made all the right choices, we wouldn't get to see this lovely Let me thing. Out. Diagnosis. It forgets everything it is. Anger. Rage. Distance. Poverty. The lonely soul is lonely again. Love turns to mockery. Oh. It dies. It is reborn. Worse. Lonelier. Let. Me. 
out. Uh, you're really not going to like what happens next. Nah, I think I think I'm gonna enjoy no, no, no. this. No, no, what's what's happening to us? Let me out. This is all too much. I can't keep going. You can't keep going. Well, what are you talking about? Oops, I think I broke you. Oh. I'll see you soon. You'll know what to do. Your body is dead, but you live on. What the f What the fuck is going on? Okay. The moment of clarity. You're on a path in the... Shit. Shit. What? What the hell was that? Who are we? What are we doing? Um, wow, okay. Uh, that just happened. Hi, uh, Sean Robinson, how are you? Welcome, welcome to the stream, unless you're already here. Uh, we get every voice now. Oh, do we? Oh, wow, this is another one of those things. Let me do another save here. I don't know if that matters, but... There was a princess, I think. Oh, fuck so, off. So Hate this guy. It hurts when I try to remember. You shouldn't know about the princess. At least, not until I... You've already been here, haven't you? You've been here millions of years. I guess. It, it feels so long ago, almost like we've never left. We have to let her out. No! No, that's the opposite of what you're here to do. You have to slay her. Slay, we decided not to do that, didn't we? Yeah, we're supposed to let her out. It's really the only way this works out for us. If you think about it, she's the one with power here. Nobody else can do much of anything. That's true. No, we were supposed to keep her trapped there forever, I think. That was our original goal. We're supposed to be unfeeling. How many times do I have to tell you to snuff out your heart? We can't be unfeeling. Not when there's so much fear everywhere. There's nothing for us to do. We've already tried everything. Yeah. We love her, so we have to set her free. Can we love something that hates us? Yes. Love something that hurts us? Yes. To be given an ounce of kindness from something so cruel would be more pure than any other love. Why are there so many of us? There aren't supposed to be so many of us. This is bad. You need to get a grip. What did you let happen? How many times have you been here? Like once. I think they're all wrong. That's a good question. How many times have you all been here? Actually, I kind of want to know. What if we don't go to the cabin? Can you make sense of them? I feel so disjointed. I don't know if I can pull this off. I don't know if I can slay her. Proceed to the cabin. The only way out is to do nothing. Nothing I will do. Stay here where you are. Uh, ooh, the broken. Yeah, broken. Ugh. Uh, yo, I'm back. Welcome back, Sun God Nika. Uh, hello. Uh, what happened? Well, I broke reality multiple times. I don't know <laughs> what else I can say. Uh, the smitten just surprised me. LOL. He is so different. He really is. Uh, some weird things happened, and now we're in the nightmare realm. Everything happened. Sun got it. Uh, if you do nothing... That leads to grabby hands. Okay. Lol. Um, so yeah, I tried kind of just doing some other stuff that we've we've not done, which is um I tried locking her in the basement forever. Uh she became like a specter and stopped my heart. Then she became a very pretty lady with a mask. Uh and I threw my knife away and um she took off her mask and uh, turned into darkness. 
Uh, and I think that pretty much explains everything here, right? Uh, you tried staying with the realm, and this happens. Oh, you tried to uh, stay with your nightmare, and this is what happens. Yeah, you know what? My nightmares are actually a lot worse than that, so... Um, I mean, have you guys ever had a dream in which two elderly wizards stand on either side of your head while you're laying in your bed and just scream back and forth at each other paranoid phrases? That's my nightmares. Do not forget about the Den Beast. Oh yeah, we, we also uh, fought a, a dog. I don't even remember what she was anymore. Uh, for a while. What if I don't go to the cabin? Can you make sense of them? Uh, that's a good question. How many times many, have you been here? Many, many, many times. It feels like we've been here forever. But it also feels like we've barely been here at all. Okay. It doesn't matter. Oh, shut up. Yes, we just have to do what she says, and then everything will be fine. Okay, opportunist. I get, I get your deal. You won't. A dog princess? She turned into a wild animal. Um, yeah, I mean, she was kind of like a weird half cat, half horse, uh, half antlered man, um, tiger man, lion thing that swallowed us at one point. And, uh, that's why the title of this video is There's Not Gonna Be Any Vore. It will be for us. She said so. You're part of everything. If things aren't fine for everything, they won't be fine for you. There's no difference between fine and not fine. It just goes on and on. <laughs> it's true. Uh, I think they're all wrong. But that doesn't make sense. I only remember being here twice before this. And some of you don't seem to remember uh, being here at all. What does here even mean, if you really think about it? I mean, we are floating in a void. I, this may be the afterlife. Another furry. Um, no, I, w I would say um, this was more... Have you ever seen the film The Walrus? Or whatever that is. Walrus Man or something. It, it was a film in which a man is turned into a walrus. It was that. Shut up. You were here. Another. Every single time. <laughs> You did your best, really. There's just a pecking order. Tusk. That's it. Tusk. It was just Tusk. And our cruel and beautiful goddess. But less funny. Right where she's always belonged. You're lucky. What I would give to be able to forget. I've tried to keep them numb. But they're all too soft. A shame, really. Mm, I'm not a big fan of the cold, either. I think they're all wrong. Of course we're wrong. That movie was creepy as fuck. Forgot the plot. It... I mean, I thought it was funny. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. There might be something wrong with me, but I thought it was goofy. Uh, when to stream... Uh, when does dreams you can go back and watch the videos? All right. When does dream? She's the only thing that's right. Oh, when the stream ends, I see. <laughs> when the dream ends, this is kind of a dream, yes, isn't it? Obviously, they're all wrong. What are you going to do about it? Uh, what if we don't go to the cabin? We've tried that. <laughs> we have tried. <laughs> the fact of the matter is, if this was the first ending, none of this would make sense. But the truth is, we have tried that. Work. Our hearts always brought us back to her. The deck is stacked. So many paths, and they're all circles. Um, I feel so disjointed. I don't know if I can pull this off. Um. Uh, don't think about that too hard. All it will do is weaken your resolve and make it that much harder for you to slay her. Maybe you're shattered in your own way. Ugh. Are you your memories? Or are you the one perceiving the present moment? Ugh. Here you go philosophizing again. <laughs> it never goes anywhere. 
Yes, this is far from the first time you've asked us about consciousness. Who am I? What am I? <laughs> what is I? Who even cares? They're good questions. Great questions, even. But they don't have any answers. And they all just end in quivering torment. This one feels a bit it like... It matter what we do, because we always find her. And if we don't find her, she always finds us. All of these voices seem to be kind of like they've turned on me a bit. Or maybe they've all given up. Like they don't none of them are truly trying anymore. Uh three. Uh all the paths make a circle. All the paths make a circle. Make a cir Oh my god. <laughs> I can't even read that. I just started repeating read this make a circle. All these paths make a circle. All these paths make a circle. Circles make a path. And then she smashes us into smaller pieces. If you all just stopped feeling, we could have been done with this ages ago. Nah, man. Your thoughts are far too scattered to rein back in. Your only option is to silence them. Okay. Proceed to the cabin. You slowly make your way through the umbral forest bumping against unseen trees not your friends yeah darkness for a way uh yeah because they've been here before like a million years now oh okay but eventually you do make it to the cabin oh it just goes straight or to the mirror you make it to the place a cabin should have been instead all you find is an empty hill no no this isn't right oh there's a cabin there there's always supposed to be a cabin there don't ask him about the mirror. He always says he never sees it. He always lies. And he always makes it gone. Ah. Oh. Stay focused. You still have a job to do, and it's best not to be distracted by fraying thoughts. There is no mirror. You know that as well as I do. There goes the narrator's influence. So he did that. Okay. Still here, buried deep inside the earth. Just walk up the hill. You always give too much space to the others. It's why you always lose. And what's wrong with giving them space? What if it helps them? What if they need to be heard? They've been heard too much. It's why they are the way they are. Exactly. They are delusions, and all that catering to them will do is drag you down to their level. Oh, you eat. have to keep moving. Eat shit, narrator. Or you could just give up. Damn, even the hero has gone completely. I'm wondering if this is... You walk up the hill, hesitating huh. just beyond the bounds of the cabin. The cabin that isn't there. You've got to clean the mirror, haven't you? <laughs> You've got to see what's in it. Smash it to pieces. She's on the other side. And we have to let her out. It's the only way we can be free. Uh, the cold is... Oh, is there's an area of influence again, too. Uh, the cold is a depressed emo. <laughs> yeah, for real. It's uh, the only way we can have our thoughts back. Just go around it. Just can we do, do that? Something. Okay, there's no Proceed. there's no options. Okay. Proceed to where? I'm afraid you're going to have to be a little more specific. That's a new one. Do you think it'll work? Of course it'll work. He always makes the best decisions. It's why he gets to make them. And it already has worked. It's gone, don't you see? Oh. We're one step closer to her. The interior of the cabin is much the same as the exterior of the cabin. A dull, fuzzy, dreamlike nothing. It's empty and isolating, but there's just enough vague shape and unknown texture to suggest the structure therein. Wrong and unsettling as it may be, the only object of note is a pristine blade buried in the dirt floor, a hint of its shining edge teasing through the sediment. Mm. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you're going to do this right. Take it. It's the only way forward. Oh. It's the only way forward. You already tried everything else. Don't you remember? 
You have to take the blade. Take the blade. Oh my god, I love this! I'm... I am genuinely loving this right now. <laughs> I love these weird ones. Um... I guess you have to take the blade. Oh, one? Alright, take the blade. You reach down to Ooh, I was about to say something weird's gonna happen with the ground. ground beneath it shifts, the weapon sinking deep into the earth. You lean over the hole and gaze into the abyss. It is so very deep. Uh, what is that that saying? Be careful gazing into the abyss, uh, for the monsters can crawl out and eat your face. In the bowels of the earth, oh no! <laughs> you see something staring There she you. is! It fills you with dread. It's a... Uh, She's watching us. She never stops watching us. You really are a coward. Why? With every word she speaks, oh. the princess in the pit blinks closer. Oh, when I said that way back when. Ugh. You know that, right? Closer. Oh, no. I was having some fun, and I guess I wanted to see if I could not you. Oh Watching god. Over me forever? That was so brave. Um when you look into the abyss, be wary what gazes back. That's one of them, but there's another one I'm thinking of. Be careful for staring into the abyss for you might become the monster or something. Bruh, is she a Five Nights at Freddy's character? Uh she, honestly, I'm getting that vibe. That weird animatronic vibe. But forever is so, so long, and time erodes everything. Except for me. Oh, okay. I've already taken your will, and you're not getting it back. What? And it's not for you to take my will. Oh, okay. And what? Me. Out. It'll be so much fun. You and me, together, exploring the world and spreading fear wherever we go. Well, mostly just me. But you'll get to be there, too. You know what? I'm kind of into that choice. I mean... A witness. I can even make you a little cage if you want. <gasps> Gilded and everything. Can it be a fish tank? Now, don't pause. Don't try to resist. I've already molded you into what I need. And you lost your power so long okay. ago. Okay. Uh, you have to take her hand. Okay. I have no problem with that. Do something. Do anything that isn't taking her hand. <laughs> I don't think I have a choice anyway. You extend your hand to hers. For all her past cruelties, the moment feels gentle. Tender, even. You know what? I can't believe you just made me say that. I hate you. I hate you. The motion is difficult at first, as if something still resists oh. your efforts. But then that resistance gives way, and it's over. See, birds live in cages, she thought of you. Mm, yeah, but haven't you ever heard the um the 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 age-old expression uh, a bird in an aquarium is equal to a fish in a bird cage? I made that up. <sighs> and oh that's my. The end. I wonder what we're going to do next. You know what? I am into this design, and I like the triple arm thing. I didn't think I'd be so... tired. Oh. Well, you can take a nap. The princess exhausted slumps. Why is it so cold? Well, because we're out outside, and it's winter. Don't think about it. Bye. I kind of like that princess, I'm not gonna lie. No? Okay. <laughs> Can we do one more for tonight? Yeah, absolutely. She's gone. Yeah. I can finally think again. That mirror's back. What does that mean for us? I'm sure it'll be whisked away just like her. Maybe it won't be gone. Things are different now, aren't they? It doesn't seem like there's much else to do here. Finally, we can smash it. 
Why is his obsession with that? With the smashing. You know, for once, cold, I feel you. What do we say, boys? One last vain attempt to look at ourselves. Yeah. I think I'd like that. Oh, really? The voice of the hero's into it now. Majority. All that's left is to give it a look. All right. You step towards the mirror once more. Its secrets remain hidden. Its mysteries remain unresolved. So it tells me that this is the end of the line. But I don't feel bad about it. Aw, I like that. It feels okay. The fears Oh. Oh, everybody gets a happy ending on this one. I'm done fighting. My heart feels quiet. Oh, that doesn't feel as good. The game was always going to end. I'll be free of all of you. Oh, fuck you. I'm ready for the truth. Yeah. I'm ready to sleep. Aw. I'm just ready to be anywhere that isn't here. That, that's Boys, fair. it's been an honor. <laughs> okay. I like this ending. I'm liking this one so far. Uh, make sure you listen to the voices at this part. Uh, LOL, a vain attempt. Uh, love puns. Uh, silence as you reach forward. They're gone once again. The mirror always makes them leave, but you need to see what it is. You've unraveled. You find yourself in the long quiet once again. Proceed to the cabin. You're at the cabin. There's a world beyond the endless oh. walls of the long quiet. I am curious to see what it means for us to know it. Uh, do you think there are people out there? Do you think blah, blah, blah? We've actually know all this stuff, I think. Uh, do you know what's going to happen when you awaken? When you send me back, I'm not alone. There are voices, they speak to me. Some of them are me, but then there's something else. I call him the narrator. Uh, turn the voices. Turn the voices, but... Uh, you include the... in. Ugh, gosh, I can't read. Uh, turn the voices, but if you include hero, it counts as 11 voices. Okay, I see. You have one more princess? That's it? Alright, I'm ready to go back. The next time I see you, each of us will finally know what we are. I will be here, waiting for you. Ooh, oh god, I jumped again. Uh, everyone is free from the pain of forever. They're talking about the voices. <laughs> Not me, damn! I guess I'm stuck in forever. Uh, and I can't spell properly. I can't either. I'm gonna be honest with you. The hero and the princess. A scattered vessel. A moment of clarity to her. I like that ending. Woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Uh, no way you do not figure out what she wants to figure out this. Well, you're not going to know now. Uh, doesn't she just want... Oh, the vessel! Oh, shit. You're here to slay her. Yeah, I forgot the vessel. Oh, well. It's fine. Uh, if this is our last princess, I can always look it up and I can I can just recite it for everyone. In fact, uh, what was that? The moment of clarity. I'll just I'll just open up a quick thing. I'll look it up. Uh, slay the princess. The moment of clarity. Uh, I'll just open up the wiki. I'll uh, I'll be brief and I won't look at any any spoilers. Does it say on here? 
uh, the moment of clarity, blah, blah, blah. Uh, this one is filled with sadness. A doll abandoned to the company of her darkest impulses. She desires only companionship, but the only thing she knows is how to hurt. Oh, that's actually genuinely sad. Uh, she will make for a tender heart. Do not mourn her. She has finally found her way home. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you guys actually posted it. Sorry. Uh, so who's picking this one? Uh, yes, the Mona Clarity. Uh, this one is filled with sadness. She will make. Yeah. Okay. Mr. Turtle, Starfall, God, set. Boom, 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 boom. I do love the music in this game. It's so great. <laughs> it's just great. It's wonderful. Uh, you got this one? All right. I'll, I'll let you lead the way. Sorry, I missed your turtle. The speakerphone does not work sometimes. Uh, what did I say? Uh, oh, I think I think I just said uh, you've got this one. I'm letting you take the reins. Uh, <clears throat> the end of the world? What are you talking about? Have you considered that maybe the only reason she's going to end the world is because she's locked up? Uh, killing a princess seems kind of bad. Can't someone else do this? Uh, forget it. I'm not doing this. Have you considered that maybe I'm okay with the world ending? Do I get some sort of reward for doing this? Oh, okay. Thanks for telling me. Sweet. I've always wanted to end a monarchy. Uh, silently continue or turn around and leave. Uh, my speakerphone does not work. So I'm picking. Yep, go for it. Uh, this will be our last one of the night, though. Uh, which I think this is actually going to be like the full on end where we can see it. So it might go for a little longer than. Uh, than uh, just a single run. What time is it? Actually, it's almost 11. Turn around and leave. Okay. Seriously? You're just going to turn around and leave? I was told to. Uh, okay, fine. You're persistent. I'll go to the cabin. Okay, fine. I'll go to the cabin. I'll talk to the princess. Maybe I'll slay her. Yes, I definitely know where I'm going. Nope. Uh, the only thing that matters is where I'm not going. I'm actually pretty okay with the world ending. Uh, quietly continue down the path. Boom, 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 boom. Quietly continue down the path. Uh, I might go to bed early. I'm not leaving yet, but just thinking about it. Um, Fine. I suppose you just quietly continue down the path away from the cabin. That is totally cool. Sorry, uh, <laughs> I was just going to let him talk. That is absolutely cool. I understand. Uh, I am, was planning on ending at 11 tonight just so I could get some sleep. But uh, we'll, we'll see how this one goes. We'll see what we get here and where we're, we're kind of ending up at. Uh, but I don't. Uh, I don't know where we're going. <laughs> so, but I do absolutely understand. I, and I hope you get a good night's sleep. And thank you so much for joining us on the stream. Uh, the music is very 90s JRPG. It does. It kind of has that, that kind of vibe. It also kind of has like that. Um, Stranger Things kind of doom, 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 doom thing going. I keep repeating. Good. What we're being asked to do here is wrong. 
Better to wash our hands of this whole situation than to take part in it. 12 a.m. Jeez. Ignore that annoying little voice. He doesn't know That's what he's a... talking about. That's very late. I used to go to sleep at like 8 o'clock. <laughs> it looks like this path also leads to the cabin. How convenient. Everything's back on track again. Maybe the world can still be saved after all. Uh, but then I started taking my uh, turn around and leave again. Again. Okay, I'm going to the cabin. Sheesh. Uh, but I, I, I used to I used to go to bed really early. Uh, and then I started taking my, my brain medication and it uh, I stopped going comatose all the time. And now I now I now I'm back at the point that I'm I'm hyper fixating on things. Uh, option two, okay. You're really keen on wasting everyone's time, aren't yeah. you? Yeah, it's remarkably selfish, if you ask me. I've already outlined the stakes of the situation. If you don't do your job, everyone dies. Like dies, dies, forever. I don't care. I'm not killing a princess. Good, maybe everyone should die. It's what they get for dumping me into the woods and asking me to kill someone. Uh, you're not emotionally blackmailing me into doing this. Quietly continue down the path. Man, this is such a wonderful like this 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 calming music i think that's also kind of what adds to the atmosphere of me getting sleepy when i'm playing this uh quietly continue got it your silence is deafening <laughs> fuck you but fine you turn around and trek back down the path you came oh would you look at that you're at <laughs> such an again. asshole now, i'm not normally one for superstition or astrology but i have to say it seems like the universe itself is doing its best to bring you to your fated confrontation with the princess uh there's no fighting this is there oh yeah well i guess i start walking in a different direction again in fact i'm going to just keep trekking through the wilderness until i find my way out of this place Honestly, I like this ending. It's just like, okay, whatever, man. Option one. Oh, okay. There's always a choice. But let me tell you right now that you're making the correct decision for pretty much everyone. We can't just go through with this and listen to him. She's a princess. We're supposed to save princesses, not slay them. Proceed into the cabin. The interior of the cabin is almost entirely bare. The blade is your implement. You uh, explore, take the blade, or enter the basement. Maybe just punch, punch, punch him. You know, it could be fun. Pardon me, I'm so sorry. One second. I received an email, which is unusual, as this is not a time that I normally receive emails. <laughs> okay, nothing important. Uh, okay, uh, take the blade, uh, implement. You take the blade from the table. If we want to do this right, okay. It'd be rather difficult cool. to slay the princess and save the world without. Explore, it. take the blade. Okay, gotcha. Into the basement. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a staircase faintly illuminated by an unseen light in the room below. This is an oppressive place. The air feels heavy and damp. Her voice carries up the stairs. Who's there? Your mom? She sounds dangerous. It's almost as if she's the one. Don't let it fool you. Skip this part. Yep. Okay. Hi. Just checking in on you. Uh, hi. I think I'm here to slay you. Continue down silently. I'm going to stab her. <laughs> I'm going to stab you. Lol. Continue down the stairs. Up 
Section number two. Oh, it's been so long since anyone's come down here. I was starting to think they'd forgotten about me. How could I forget about someone as lovely you walk down the stairs and horrifying as you? Eyes with the princess. We've There's had a such a chain around her. She's so focus on the task. We've oh, had such a, a long are. history together. Are you here to kill me or something? No way! Okay, yeah, you caught me. I'm here to kill you. Uh, nuh uh. I haven't decided yet. I'm just here to talk. Steal your nerves and step forward. Housekeeping. Uh, you hate the part when the narrator says if she's down here probably doing her favor. I don't know why. It's just he seems like he's interjecting that. It feels so manipulative, and I hate that line. No. -uh. Ow. Something bit me again. She bit me. Oh. <laughs> the cursor was sitting on her forehead. I thought she had a horn. <laughs> a three maybe. <laughs> okay. Uh, nah. Then drop the knife. Oh. We should. It'll go a long way to building trust with her. Don't you dare. It's fine. We can decide what we want to do after we talk to her. Maybe she really is a monster. Killing someone in cold blood isn't very becoming of us. Throw the blade at her. Uh, mosquito season is night. Is nice. Mosquitoes. Yeah, we get them pretty bad out here, and it just rained. Like it, had, we've had like a thunderstorm or a rainstorm all day, so they're gonna get bad over the next few days. But you know what? Why is there no mosquito princess? That's upsetting. Actually, is there? They did say they were bringing at least more more content for this game. I think, right? Uh, option two. You ignore the trembling in your hands and tighten your grip on the blade. You poor thing. Your hands are shaking. Are you scared of me? Because you should be. I'm not scared of anything. You step forward, except for snakes. Your grip on the blade tightening as you steal your resolve. And being eaten alive. I'm probably chained up in this basement for a reason, right? And if that knife is the only weapon you have, you'll have to get close. Enough. So you should just drop it. Best not to risk finding out what I can do. Uh, get got slapped by Saitama. Uh, lol. Play big monstrous princess. Huh? She's unarmed. If you hesitate now. Uh, what if she isn't bluffing? What if she kills us? I'm sorry, can we just talk? I'm not dropping the blade. Drop the blade. <laughs> Slay the princess. Play big monstrous princesses. Is that a uh, is that a game? Uh, I'm sorry. Can we just talk? You're so close. Don't give. No, this is a good idea. Maybe we can de-escalate things. Oh, threatened are we? You poor thing. Drop the knife, and of course we can talk. I'm not dropping the blade. Drop the blade. Slay the princess. Uh, when you said you have fears, I was trying to say, oh, of big monstrous princesses. Yeah, okay, I gotcha. Uh, you were asking about a mosquito princess, and there was a really sassy mosquito queen monster in One Punch Man. Oh, One Punch Man! I haven't seen that in a long time, I'm afraid, so I don't really get the references. Then I'm not talking to you. Well, then I'm not talking to you, talking to Blade. I'm going to talk to the Blade. Fine, then. I guess we're at an impasse. Squint at the princess while holding onto the blade. Drop the blade or slay that princess. I'm gonna kiss that princess. I guess we are. 
for the love of everything, just slay her already. No. Or drop the blade. Do something. Never. Are you sure you don't want to talk? Stare at the princess while holding onto the blade. Drop the blade or slay the princess. Uh... Princess, are you the same princess that sat on that mattress with the pee and you peed on the mattress and there was like a whole story about it? You stare at the princess, squinting fiercely. She squints back. <laughs> okay. The two of you are going to do this forever, aren't you? Maybe. You have to blink eventually. Just make a choice. Drop the blade or slay the princess. Okay, that felt like a, a big a nothing sandwich, but okay. <laughs> Them's the chains, I guess. It's a squint off. I would have loved for this to be just an ending where the arms just come out and take us both. <laughs> this one is a stubborn vessel. Option number one, drop the blade. <sighs> The blade tumbles out of oh, I heard her sigh and drops to the floor with an unceremonious clang. Thank you. Maybe now we can just talk. Slay the princess! Against your better judgment, we'll be fine. I don't know what you're hoping to accomplish here, but I can assure you there's no reasoning with her. <sighs> just make sure you don't forget about the blade on the floor. So here we are. What an awkward start to a relationship. Yeah, it's uh, pretty awkward. A relationship? Are you coming on to me? How do I get you out of here? I'm here because you're supposed to end the world. Uh, there's people you're going to end the world. What do you have to say about it? What's your name? How long have you been down here? Uh, do you know why I'm here to kill you? Okay, we've talked enough. Uh, the narrator side, one. Her eye seems weirdly big. It really is. This first like encounter with her, she's got like these weird, like I know. Eyes. I just said that. Now why are you here to kill me? I don't know. Uh, I have my reasons. Do you think I'd just come here to kill someone without even knowing why? That's ridiculous. Do you know why I'm here to kill you? You're supposed to end the world. I've been told things, but I'm not sure what to believe. Stop staring at me with them big ol' eyes. Wink. Option number three. You're supposed to end the world. Don't just tell her that. Well, then if she doesn't know, then I don't know, That's man. That's cute. Do you believe that? Do you think I'm some sort of... <laughs> monster? Not yet. If I'm supposed to be capable of ending the world, then how did I wind up here, chained to a wall? Have they told you why I'm allegedly so dangerous? A uh, deflect. Uh, what are you going to do if I let you out of here? I've been told enough. I was hoping you'd tell me no, but I'm uh, sure they have their reasons. Uh, no, and if I'm being honest, I'm more inclined to trust you than the uh, inclined to trust them. Remain silent. You have like a stray hair here, princess. Would you be very upset if I took it and made it mine? I'm more inclined to trust you. Sooner or later, you'll understand that I have your best interests at heart. Hopefully sooner. No, you don't. You just want to kill death. How sweet. Now be a pal and help me get out of here, would you? We can figure out how to deal with them after I'm free. No. 
I still have a few more questions. Slay the princess. Actually, I've changed my mind. I don't trust you. Examine the chains. I'll see what I can do. Princess, I want your hair. I want to be the princess now. <laughs> oh, God. I just thought of a raven, like, ripping a person's hair off and then putting it on their own head and walking around and acting like a princess. At that point, I think... I would get slain. I would be the princess and I would be slain. Uh, do you remember the damsel ending? Yes. Yes, I do. Where we free her, I think. And, and she like falls for me the one that feels really bad uh, we're going to do that exact opposite or something is the same here or someone is the same here okay so do we go for the slayer then option three okay you walk up to the chains binding the princess to the wall and give them a tug. They're large and heavy, far too solid for you to even imagine trying to break them apart. I'm guessing you don't have the key. Maybe it's somewhere upstairs. Doubtful. Whoever locked the princess away down here intended for her to never see the light of day. They wouldn't have just left the key to her chains somewhere in the cabin. They might have. And if there isn't a key, what do you have any ideas? I'm going to check upstairs. Maybe there's a key. It's something similar to the damsel ending. Okay. Well, you do have that big, sharp knife. You could always cut me out of here. I'll start at the shoulder and then you tell me when to start cutting. She speaks with almost complete nonchalance. Except I took we the blade. Stuck down okay. Here for long enough, I'm sure we'd be nonchalant about cutting our way out. Anything to finally be free. You attempt to make your way out of the basement, but the door at the top of the stairs slams shut. You hear the click of a lock sliding into place. Is someone else here? Hey, let me out of here. Try the door. Return to the bottom of the stairs. Uh, quick, get the lock picking lawyer. Uh, that guy from YouTube that, uh, like you, you send him locks and stuff, it's right? From the outside. Get him in here. You're here to slay the princess, and you won't leave until the task is done. You know what would have been a really insane way to do this game? Get a bunch of internet personalities just to be themselves in your head. Hey, let me out of here. Please are met with silence. I'll repeat myself once again. You're here to slay the princess and you won't leave until the task is done. Fine. Return to the bottom. You make your way back to the bottom of the stairs. This easier for whom? Easier for everyone. I heard the door slam. They locked you down here too, didn't they? Yeah. The knife. Pick it up and cut me out of here. All right. Do I start at the neck or the leg? Which way do you want me to go? You won't like what happens if you do that. Save the princess or slave the princess. Not slave. That that was a that was a, not that was that was a poor choice of words. I was trying to make a cool little rhyme. Uh, don't speak too soon. What? I'm going to cut all your hair and wear your scalp as a mask. A hat. Against your better judgment, you place the blade against the princess's arm just above the massive, unyielding chain. This would be the best point 
to demonstrate that both of these characters are crazy by going for a kiss. You cut into her flesh. You'll figure out what I'm in next time. Oh, okay. The blade is sharp. And you oh, I hate that. Before long, you're able to crack through bone, and she pulls the bleeding stub of her arm through the iron gauntlet. She didn't so much as utter a sound. Free from her bindings, the princess turns to face you, her fierce gaze meeting your eye. How is she so composed after losing an arm? It's like she isn't even bothered by it. Thank you. Now let's get out of here. Okay. Approach the locked door. No, we won't have any of that. The stakes are too high. You can't just let her escape into the world. No. Uh, as the princess approaches oh. the bottom stair, your body steps stab, 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 and stab. raises the blade. Uh, the nonchalance is unsettling. Oh, well, right. <laughs> this isn't fair. You can't just do yeah. that. Watch me. Do we slay the princess? I've always wanted to slay a princess. Warn her? Okay. I guess. I guess it'd be more tragic if we warn her Stop than that. slay her. I thought this was a little too easy. Oh. Your body lunges forward to sink the blade into her back, but the princess swiftly moves out of the way before you can connect. Okay. Stop it. Stop resisting me. I am trying to get you out of here alive. Slay the princess. Resist. Or slay the princess. Warn her? I can resist. I cannot resist her alluring charm. That was a very poor French accent. Mon chari. Uh, mon petit. Cheval. Or was this? Oh. The blade. Pretty sure Move I just called her a small horse. Blade. No! You're doing your best to help me, aren't you? I can see the conflict in your eyes. This isn't conflict. I'll make this quick. Okay. She steps forward and pries the blade from your rigid hands. Maybe I'll see you in another life. I guess, if we must, oh. Then she slits your throat with an almost clinical ease. Don't drink the blood. Her face remains unchanged as she watches you collapse to the ground, blood flowing from your butchered neck. Yeah, I see it now, this but this time she doesn't love me. I'm afraid it is. Uh, you see, goes yes, dark, yeah, sorry, that, I did forgot to read the comment. I hope it was worth it. It was the prison. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Hmm. Um, okay, let's see. Let me just check the time real quick. So it is 11.16 for me. Uh... We probably won't get to the end tonight, is how I'm feeling. So what we might do is we'll go ahead and finish this run off next week. Uh, that being said, uh, this week there won't be, I won't be streaming on Tuesday as I'm having some eye surgery done. He sounds angry. Oh, the narrator? Or me? I'm not angry. I love being angry, but I'm not angry. <laughs> uh, I'm cool with stopping here. Okay, so uh, the next week we'll probably con continue with this. I don't know how much more there is to this game. Um, so we might do this and another game next week. But uh, for right now, I think I think this is a decent place to stop. We'll, we'll, we'll check out the prisoner next time. Um, let me do a... <laughs> let me make sure I save. Oh my god, we have so many save slots. Okay. 
Remember page 10. Uh, save game. Yeah. <laughs> uh, narrator before he had a bounce to his voice, like the, there was a friendly quest giver. This one sounded like he was gritting. Oh, I didn't notice it. I need to pay more attention. Um, let's see here. Go ahead and, are you sure you want to quit? Of course. Um, okay. So with that, I think we'll, we'll call it quits for the night. Uh, obviously. Uh, where are we playing Slay the Princess again? Yeah, we'll we'll do uh, Slay the Princess. It'll probably be Friday, uh, as I'm having um some eye surgery this week, and I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to see too well. Uh, but Friday I should be healed up. So. Um, so we're doing this next time. Yeah, we'll, we'll finish this off next time and, uh, kind of, kind of round it off. Then we, we might do some other games. I don't know how much more there is to it. I don't know if we'll have enough to finish a whole night off, but we might, we might do something else as well. Uh, paging 10 paging Dr. 10. Uh, yes. Uh, we could do Saturday then, uh, Friday probably will happen. I, I, I think we'll be good on Friday. Uh, like I said, it's just, it's, it's not a, a super serious surgery. I just don't, I haven't had it done yet and I have to have like three, three operations of it. So we'll see how that goes, but thank you all so much for joining me on this one. Uh, does anybody need to take a look at their avatar stuff before you need to say something, go for it. I'm looking at you, Kenneth. Oh, crap. My brain broke. My head broke. Have a good night. See you next time. Absolutely. Um, can I get an avatar link, please? Absolutely. Let me post that. I, I, hopefully by next week, I'll have this figured out. But like I said, I'm not going to have a huge amount of time this week to work on stuff. Uh. Oh, that was not the right command. Okay, well, you guys are about to have a battle royale, I guess. Sorry. <laughs> Let me grab that link again. Uh, good night, everyone. Hope that everyone has a good night dash day. Uh, the battle royale is starting. I'm so sorry. Uh, that's okay, Mr. Turtle. LOL. We've been ambushed. 50 bucks I win. Oh, God. Uh, I'll post that also <laughs> in the chat. I'm sorry. I did not mean to do that. I thought I had that other one saved. Paste. I need to get that set up so you guys can actually uh, send in your commands. Oh, it looks like Cryo won. Awesome. Congratulations. I, I think you got some coins there as well. As well as a uh, an egg loot box. Five hundred gold, nice. Why do I almost die first? Uh, I, I'm right there with you. These kind of battle royale uh, games, I die almost immediately. That's why I don't play them. There we go. And did that actually post? Hey, apparently you got the uh, OMG, you're a parent. You got the uh, baby burb. Congratulations. Uh, I think everyone should have already had that, but dang. <laughs> everyone should actually already have that, so I'm not sure why that gave it to you again. Dang, I knew I should never gamble. <laughs> gambling's a gambling's, uh, risky maneuver.
Um, all right. I don't think that posted, did it? Let me try that again. So you guys can. Uh... There we go. Try that. There we go. That way you guys can. Oh, my gosh. Everyone's jumping. That's the... <laughs> that startled me a little bit. Shouldn't have, but it did. Yeah, uh, I need to do, I need to do some work on the the dinosaur model. Uh, there's some bugs with that one. Like I said, I did that one pretty quickly today. I had to completely redo it, uh, and there's, it's missing a few of the new items I had. What, what is? Oh God, I broke something. I'm liking your little your little uh necromancer look going on here, uh cryo. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oh, I, I, I didn't actually make the bird to work with the horns, but I'm glad it actually does, now that I'm looking at it. I think um, as of right now, the only model that doesn't have access to the uh, the bird will be Block Boy, as he is not mine to work with, and uh, I don't know how to open it up. The most attack. I don't think any particular avatar has any stats on them. Uh, they all kind of just randomly do stuff. Uh, there, it's it, it, think of it more as it's all cosmetic. Uh, but I will be I will be adding some attack animations and things like that. Like I said, I'm not great at animating things, so <laughs> or or 2D art for that matter. But I wanted everyone to have some custom stuff, and uh, I, I I I haven't really done anything to try to find somebody who could do it. Uh, I know some people uh, were saying that there's some really cheap or, or cheap places to get some sprites, though. So I'll also be adding some more colors. Um, I'll work on that, that transparent one and get you something a little bit more transparent. I think we'll make like a transparent for all the skins. There's a secret ending uh, in Slay the Princess. Can I interest you uh, of a new game that I would like to play and make a video about? Sure, absolutely. Um, like I said, I have a, I have, I have quite a bit of things on the list, but um, I, I, I try to get, I try to get recommendations in as quickly as I can. I'm now red. <laughs> I, 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 this was actually the first one, the little globlets. Uh, these were the first one I did just to test it out. And I really like them. Um, they're just like weird little goopy guys. But um, have you heard of Animash? I have not heard of Animash. Uh, YouTube does not like mobile avatar shenanigans. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure this out. Um, I was trying to figure out a way that you could just type it into chat and do stuff uh, without it spamming everyone with, like, the jump command and everything, but uh, YouTube also doesn't like the uh, whisper command that it has. So that's not... It doesn't actually work. Uh, 
Um, we'll, 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 we'll try it. We'll, I'll keep trying and playing around with this and see what we got. We, we can get going. Um, as far as Animash, I will give it a look and uh, see if it's something we can actually have on the channel. As long as it's not like lewd or deadly chores. I haven't heard of that one either. Um, but like I said, I'll take a look at those. Let me write those down real quick. Let me just pull back open my notepad. Deadly chores and animash. Dicey's Dungeons could be fun. I have heard of Dicey Dungeons. Uh, one of my one of my favorite YouTubers actually plays. Actually, I've been meaning to say this, and I keep forgetting. Uh, one of my favorite YouTubers actually plays this. Di played Dicey Dungeons quite a bit. Uh, I'll add that to the thing. Uh, but there is currently a channel that uh, if you guys are into like tabletop type games, uh, like D and D or those kind of games. Um, there is a channel called Mystery Quest, who is run by the, the same person I was just talking about. Uh, they're currently doing a dinosaur-themed uh, tabletop game. Uh, never mind, Deadly Chores is not a good game. Okay, I'll take that one off. Uh, like I said, uh, I'll take a look at anything as long as it's not lewd or horrible. TTRPG, yes, exactly. Um, but like I said, his they their mystery quest. Um, Angory Tom is the guy. Uh, he's a, a British YouTuber, uh, part of the Yogs cast, and uh, absolutely love his content. But um, if you guys are interested in that kind of thing, absolutely go check that out because it's funny. It's it's they're they're so funny and they're so good. Boom. No, his 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 is Bam, isn't it? Bam. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might have been trying something else, but it fit. Uh, Crazy Dino Park is a good game. Okay, I'll add that to the list. Crazy Dino Park. We also, another game you might be interested in us playing is um, Crazy Dino Park. Uh, it's a park sim, uh, the dinosaur, prehistoric kingdom or whatever. We have it. It's not as much of a, a game. It's more of a, like a building tycoon game, but... We do have that since since I know you uh, you are you're a dino guy. Uh oh. Just one moment, my cat has decided it's time. What do you want, oatmeal? What are you doing? You want to say hello? You wanna you wanna be part of the stream? Geez, I haven't heard of the Yogg's cast in a while. I need to rewatch their Shadows video. I actually never watched Shadows. I joined uh, up with them whenever Hat Films joined them, which I think was before that. I mean, I, I know the references, but uh, Hat Films was like the first big uh, channel I watched. And uh, then slowly uh, Tom made his channel and I got really into his stuff. He, he's, he's just a really funny, chill guy. Uh, I'm something that I'm called a dinosaur expert. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, sorry. You're more than a dinosaur guy. You've evolved beyond that. Oh, where'd you go, bud? All right. Oatmeal decided he did not want to talk to you guys. Yes, my cat's name is Oatmeal. Not my choice. Hmm. Uh, did you look at Animash yet? Not yet. Um, I'll have to pull that up later and look into it. Uh, well, I guess I could look at it right now. I guess there's not really anything stopping me. Uh, and yes, I will. I will post to his channel right now. Uh, 
Uh, but they do like a lot of like sort of like one shots, I guess you could call them. They're not like uh, serialized or anything. They have like a few videos per per game they play. Um, one of my favorites is probably uh, oh god, the Goblin Grinder one. That that one was a good one. Uh, can you type the TTPRPG channel? Uh, also, you should totally make a pet bowl with a goofy oatmeal cat to go along with your slime guy. Oh, like one of the little, little chat days. Yeah, you know what? I thought about doing that, but I have three cats, and I don't want to give one cat too much attention. <laughs> oh my god, but an oatmeal cat would be great. Uh, I was thinking in the future we could do like videos or live streams of these videos. Uh, of the uh, the dinosaur game, let me let me go pull that one up real quick. Or not the dinosaur. Fuck, uh, I was thinking of Dino Island. Uh, the Animash is that on Steam? Let me take a look here. Library, library, no store. Um. Animash. Uh, I'm not seeing Animash. Did I type that wrong? Let me... Uh, I'm not seeing Animash. Is that one on Steam or is that somewhere else? Oh, this looks like it might be a uh, a mobile game. Is it? Unfortunately, I'm not set up to record a uh, mobile games. Uh, I was thinking we in the future we could do like videos or live streams of these videos. Uh, go to games I picked for you. Uh, I just got Monster Hunter Rise and I am currently getting used to the controls. Ah, it took me forever to do that game. Uh, and yeah, we can. We, I, I've been wanting to do like a um, recommended playlist games that were recommended to me as well. Um, Bro, I couldn't chat for a second. Uh, I've had um, some other people have issues with that as well, so I'm not sure what that was, what that is. Google Play Store. Uh, yeah, it does that to me. For yes, you might have been the person who had that issue before. Yes, it is. Uh, have you heard of Ken Kenito Pet? Maybe. I Is that the one that is like a... I didn't want to wa watch anyone play it because I thought I might do it myself, but it's like a, um, it's one of those quotation mark virus games, right? That does weird things on your computer. I mean, let me look that up while we're, since we're looking, um, as far as animash, um, if it's only for mobile, I'm not set up to do that myself, um, but I'll look, I'll keep looking into it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and bookmark this under my references uh, bookmarks, okay? And uh, can 
Yes, the doxes you game. Yes, okay. Yeah, I was looking, I was thinking about doing that. Um, that is already on my list of games, so that one is there. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, it does. Uh, oh, sorry. Okay, we've already read that. Okay. Um, but yeah, yeah, absolutely. Like I said, if you guys have any recommendations, you can always leave comments. Uh, once again, I, I have my email and uh, my, my. I think, do I have my Discord on the thing? I, I need to set up a Discord chat for everyone to kind of suggest things. Um, I'll get to it one day. I, I, I keep myself too busy to, to remember anything. But um. I try to jump on recommended games before I do any games that I, I find. So uh, more than likely, uh, these kind of games you guys will probably see come up pretty quickly. Um, is Kenito Pet, is that more of a record kind of game or a stream kind of game? It's got really good reviews, though. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and bookmark this real quick. Oh, it's so cheap, too. Okay, cool. We've got that one on the list for, for, for sure now. Apparently, I wasn't following it. I guess I don't. I, I have nothing then. Um... Like I said, I'll look into that, and we might be able to get it to work. Um, I just don't know. Probably best to record it so you can blur anything. It truly does mess with your cookies and stuff. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll. Then I will probably get that. That might be a good video to put out next week. I have a question. Sure, go for it. Uh, wait, what game are we talking about? Uh, the Kimi Kim, Kimi Kimi no Pet. <laughs> the one you recommended. Uh, how old are you and what's your job? Um, I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> I am, God, I don't actually remember how old I am. Uh, I'm going to have to leave it vague because I can't remember how old I am. I am in my 30s, if that helps. Uh, how old are you and what's your job? I am actually a graphic artist. Uh, I, I, I work as a, uh, graphic artist throughout the day or throughout the week at a, uh, beer distribution company. Uh, question mark. That was a little, oh, sorry. That retracted a little personal. Um, I'm okay with that. That's, that's not too, uh. 17. There is a streamer mode. Okay. Um, sorry, my streamer. My avatar broke again. Uh, um, I'm, I'm not too worried about people knowing my age or anything like that. Uh, mostly, I just don't like the idea of people being able to find me on uh, in person. So, um, then if there is a streamer mode for that, we might, uh, we might be able to do that on stream at some point. It hides like the stuff you don't want to show on the stream. Okay. Sorry for asking. No, you're good. I, I don't mind. Now I would recommend for, for yourself. Um, oh God, my head is breaking so bad. <laughs> I would recommend for yourself to, you know. Uh, be some somewhat discreet since this is all online, you know. Um, uh, as, as for myself, I'm not too worried about it. Uh, I'm, I'm, for, are you okay? 13. Oh my gosh. Uh, I should probably, with that said, I should probably 
mention my channel's not technically meant for minors. I, I don't have any issue with you guys being here uh, at all. You you guys are all welcome to come and enjoy the content, but uh, just uh, bear in mind. <laughs> bear in mind that I I will say uh curses is that is that fair is that a fair thing to say i guess yeah just bear in mind um <laughs> just um you you okay there Kenneth you've uh you've you've got some spam going on Square words and stuff. Okay, uh, just just I, I'm making sure that I do I do share that as uh, I don't have uh, like Steam Steam has the page where it says you know be aware that this is a, a a mature content. I technically consider myself to be a mature channel, though you're not going to encounter anything too violent or horrible. Well, violent probably yes, but you're never going to experience anything too bad. I think I broke as a chat. <laughs> Uh, explicitive is the word you're looking. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so I just want to make sure that we are clear. I am technically uh, not intended for, chi for, for minors, not children. So just get that across so that we are on all this on the same page. Uh, like I said, I have no problem with you guys being here, chatting and all that. Just, uh, be careful, though. It is an internet thing. I've seen many, many things before. Okay, um, so I just, I just wanted to be very clear about that. You know, that as as the internet is a dangerous place. You know, don't don't get too too comfortable. And that's that's more of just a, a general uh, online etiquette thing. Um, let me just make sure I got every all the games written down here. Uh, we got Animash. No, wait, no, we we're going to look into that one. Uh, Dicey Dungeon, Crazy Dino Park. Did we say no on that one? No, we said no on the chore one. Okay, Crazy Dino Park. I'll I have that one on there. And then the Kimikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinikinik
But that that's gonna make it more memorable, right? The, the hard names. Uh, but yeah, that's that's kind of just my old channel. Now, um, if you do see people stealing my content, you know, let me know, and I'll 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 go after them. I I won't. I actually don't care that much. <laughs> I actually don't care. Uh, yeah. So this live just says Tour Turtle, and another video has logic. So I got confused. Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to see if I can fix. That. I might be able to change that in the future. Or in Google. I just never thought of fixing. I think there's also some other Tor Turtles online. Uh, like button down below. Like button down below. Oh, yeah, I don't promote liking myself. I should probably do that. I'm also supposed to be promoting myself more. But we'll, we'll, we'll see how we get to that. Uh, anyway, thank you all so much for joining me. I hope you guys have a good evening. Um, I don't cryo if you're going to work i i genuinely hope you have a good work day because working sucks uh actually it's fantastic if a person on youtube says like the button and subscribe they actually do it <laughs> yeah i've been told that's how that's supposed to work you're supposed to promote yourself and get that to going so uh, we'll see if that we will see if I can remember to make that a habit. It it always feels so dirty to me, like uh like telling everyone like um only one percent of you guys are subscribed, so make sure you like uh, and saying it before the beginning. Uh, good night, good day, everyone. I don't like people saying like and sub sometimes. Yeah, I feel like it's a little too seedy for me. Uh, anyway, you guys have a wonderful night and take it easy. Get some rest, all that good stuff. Bye.